I'd rather have my hair stuck in the clouds than buried in the mound. Feet touching the asphalt, back will touch the ground. You out about that trash talk, my hands speaking loud. The crowd sound is drowning our conversation now. I know what I'm about to do, can't coma induce. But look, I try not to lose, what else is there to do? I'm a fighter, hard like barbed wire, sharp the same way. I'm tired, but get energized when the crowd say showbiz, boom, by yay. Showbiz, boom, by yay. My style's impetuous, my defense impregnable. There's no B plan when the A plan is doable. My ritual, jump rope, heavy bag, cut rope. I'm the best in the world because my ego says so. A fighter, I am lost in this whirlwind. This make-believe world where it's a sin to be a grown man. Look, I never read a book, bruh. I must admit, I'm about that grit and that dumb shit. Where your head's on some drum shit. Body got bambi legs, ears on some hum shit. Later getting medicated, urine on some blood shit. I want wildest power with devil. And Haney's defense. <laughs> Up off that. Yeah. Yes. 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 Up off. Not- Y'all know what day it is. Y'all know what day it is, huh? Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. It's fight night, baby, baby. What's up, my people? This is showbiz adult. All right, man, look, look, look at who we have here. Let me see. Oh, my God. It's too damn early. Boy, uh, I forgot this fight uh, was coming up. I'm getting ready for work now. Enjoy, everybody. Uncultured. Whoa. Let me see. Allen. What's going on with you? Oops. All right, man. Look, first, first, I want to say this. Ah! Welcome to Fight Night, everybody. It's early in the damn morning, but I got my black two joggers. Look, man. Well, who's next? I just saw a body shot knockout. Uh, I saw a couple of you guys in the uh, war room saying, showbiz, you missed a knockout. No, I didn't. <laughs> because y'all don't see me on don't mean I'm not looking at the TV. I'm sitting back like, ooh, shit, <laughs> with my black two sugars. Uh, the fights in Japan are always slaughterhouse fights, bro. Like I said, when we talk about the Mexican style, it's like, yo, the Japanese style, bro. Hit the Tyson, man. <laughs> they stay slugging. Uh, let me tell you, though. I'm reeling right now. I'm on my heels. I'm on my back foot. Hold on real quick. <laughs> my man's on. Uh, good morning, Bills. What's going on with you? Uh, let me see. Uh, almost 200K sub. Yeah, everybody, sub. Sub to this channel. Look. Um, <laughs> I'm reeling right now because I just woke up from a nightmare. L- listen, I I had a nightmare. Hit the Tyson bell. You guys don't understand. I had a nightmare and it's very vivid in my head right now. So let me tell you the dream. Dude. Let me tell you this dream I just had, bro. All right. It wasn't wasn't Martin Luther King. <laughs> it's far from it, bro. <laughs> Nightmare Spence versus Crawford in a draw. <laughs> That's probably what's going to happen, dog. Jackie, listen to this nightmare. Okay. You guys ready? You guys ready? No, it has nothing to do with boxing. Actually, I think I'm sure it had a lot to do with YouTube, though. Ah! I thought about the dream. It have a lot to do with YouTube, I think. Bro, listen, listen. 
you guys know, you guys know that orange sky or whatever that came from Canada? Right? Like a couple weeks ago? Like, I guess pollution or bad air quality? So, I had a dream. My dream was that Number one, I didn't have a family in a dream. I had no family. Yeah, right, Alan. I had no family. So the dream was that that orange sky caused the military to have these bunkers, right, kind of thing um, that we all had to stay in until the sky cleared. Bro. But the funny thing is, you know, so we got a call. Everybody got like this alarming call, right? Where it's like, report to so-and-so, so-and-so, report to this. And these bunkers were like kind of by each other, right? But fenced off. And I'm walking, I'm going to my bunker. I, I arrived, actually the military in these buses picking everybody up. And I get to mine and... I'm looking, there's a line to another bunker that is like smaller. And because I'm making, I'm in a different tax bracket, I'm making a little bit more, I'm, I'm more well off. I get to go to this more plush bunker, right? <laughs> Yo, <laughs> thank you so much for a super stick. Check this out. I get to go to this more plush bunker and I'm walking and I didn't feel good about it. So I get to the guy up front finally, and I say, hey, can I exchange my bunker for one of theirs? And he said, sure. He said, I don't know why you'll want to do that, though. I said, I just felt like shit. And so I see this lady. She, she just, they, they scan her in. I said, hey, wait a minute, wait a minute. I said, let's switch. And all the other little snooty rich people are looking at me like, but I switched with the lady because it just, it just, it, it was like the most irritating thing in the world that we went to two separate bunkers based on how much money we were making. Hold on. I just won 4K at the casino. Congratulations. And got home in time to watch my favorite YouTube channel. Thank you so much. Hit the Tyson Bell. <laughs> Bro, you crazy. Bro, so I switch. All right. I get in the bunker and the bunker is shitty. So... <laughs> So I'm like, damn, this, I mean, it just, it was shitty. All right. Fine. I'm in the bunker. Make the long story short. Um, while I'm in the bunker, out of nowhere, out of nowhere, screaming and running and people beating on the door, boom, 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 trying to get in. And they're opening up the door for them and people are ah! like, yo, it was pandemonium. Like screaming coming from the rich bunker, right? Hold on, real quick. Uh, it's two in the morning. I went to Mexico and come back to my car, and I realized I left my car keys in Mexico. Damn, for vacation, this is happening. ATM, <laughs> funny, bro, bro. They, we opening up the 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 doors. They're running in. Ah, and what's behind them? Zombies, zombies who can run. Right, it was 28 days later, infected, just blood, just, just behind them and infecting them and they get around and I'm like, what the, f so I run out the bunker. <laughs> I'm like, what the, hell? and I'm looking around and it's just pandemonium. People getting chased from the back, hunted down, bit on the neck. Not only are these 28 days later infected zombies fast and moving aggressively, they can talk. They can talk and they're saying the worst things. I eat your fucking liver. Like they're just screaming, F you. I, they just raged out, right? So I'm, I'm like, screw it. I start booking it. Boom, boom. Somebody fall in front of me. I jump. It's at night and I stop. And who do I see? In the corner, like a little bit in front of me, the lady that I gave the the thing to, and her hair's down, and she's looking at me. She's like, <laughs> and she got like blood hanging, and she says, 
showbiz. And I'm like, ah! she came running at me. Now, dude, now I'm up. And they're all, a lot of them are chasing me. I'm going to hate you. F you. They're just chasing me. And I think that's where the YouTube thing, because they're making bad comments. <laughs> Bro, I'm getting chased by comments. <laughs> right? You're a cone. Yeah. Like, sell out. And I'm just like, <laughs> they just chasing me, bro. So they're they're like, they're gaining on me. I I cut a corner and I'm kind of Jackie. I'm kind of by myself now. Right? I'm just and what I see ahead of me is this big building, this apartment building that my great grandmother used to stay in in, Ch in Chicago. And I see the building and it looks like, oh, I know this building. I know this place, right? So I'm running and the comments are getting more and more faint. F yo. Yeah, moist, moist zombies. So I get in a building, and as a safe haven, what do I do? I go up to my grandmother's floor, my great grandmother. Now my great grandmother was like in her nineties, fair skinned lady, white hair, old. All right, and I get up to her floor now. Now, when when I used to go visit her as a kid, we'd call her so she can let us up. And every time, like clockwork, when we go walking down the hall to get to her room, she will have the door open already and she'll be hanging out and she'll say, who are these beautiful people? Look at this beautiful family. She did that every time. So in my dream, bro, I go up to her floor and I start running. And who do I see? My grandmother. She comes, she peek her head out the door and she says, look at this beautiful man. Bro, I'm like, <gasps> like I am terrified. And she's grinning, looking at me. And I'm like, slide, like, oh, shit. And I wake up like, ah, ah. <laughs> Miss Biss is like, what? I'm like, ah. She said, she said, it's time to do your show. <laughs> it's time. <laughs> it, it is. It is time to do your show. <laughs> and that's the black two sugars. <laughs> that was terrible. Hopefully I don't uh, pass out before the fight <laughs> again, brother. I Please stay up. I'm doing my best right now. Bro, bro, you want to talk about a nightmare. <laughs> you scared me? <laughs> no, I I'm sorry. But that was terrifying. But now I'm here. I had to get it out. <laughs> Biz pre-recorded this. <laughs> Bro, I had to get this out. So I could not, so I could not be thinking about this as I call the fight. And that's the black two sugars. Mm. <sighs> okay, let's talk. <laughs> Epic ass nightmare, though. It was it meant so much, bro. I'm pretty sure the comments was the YouTube thing. Um, and I think my grandmother was saying, you're, you're still you, you're my grandbaby. Like you're beautiful no matter what, but it was just scary, bro. It was scary, bro. Uh, let me see. Uh, those, uh, zombies didn't have enough, uh, spring to catch me. No, they couldn't catch me, bro. They couldn't catch me. I was in the wind. I do. I, I was hauling ass. <laughs> In my dream, I was hauling ass, bro. For real, for real. Uh, that's symbolism. Yeah, because all my giveaways. So I even, I gave to the woman who was talking shit about me. Like, I'm like, let's switch. No matter how much, what you do, how, no matter how much you give, they're going to hate on you, bro. I want y'all to remember that. No matter how good you try to treat people or how, what, 
they will hate on you. So the Zach, per, I'm doing all this effort. She's like, show biz. Just, bro, bro, bro. I think it was a YouTube thing. <laughs> think that dream. I'm sure it was a YouTube thing. Yeah, moist zombies, dog. <laughs> it was, it was, it was this here. It was, it was this here. It was this here. Hold on, hold on. I'm moist. I'm moist. Call and response, I said I'm moist. I'm moist. Good God, I'm moist. I'm moist. <laughs> hey, yo, that, that song is funny as shit. Hey, somebody just ate a uppercut. Like, I know I'm hungry. That that uppercut looked tasty. This brother ate a, an uppercut. It looked like a mushroom omelet. <laughs> <laughs> let me see <laughs> jack hey wait a minute jackie hold on let me do all my shit let me do all my shit here it is you, with you for me, for me. stop it biz no listen and if y'all and if y'all haven't done it already close out the chat hit the like and give it up for the bonnet with a laugh and do the cabbage patch Kiss Hit the Tyson bell. <laughs> DJ from the, 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 brother. Do you know, D, I got to I got to try to hit you up when I get to Vegas, bro. Do you know how many people, great people though, including yourself, beautiful people like you, in my DMs like, hey man, the after party here. And this is here. After the party. Let's take it a little time and talk about it. I never got so much love in my life. So thank you, DJ, for real, for you even extending like, hey, man, if you guys want to get a bite to eat, you know what I mean? I got you. You know, if you want to know where to go to do this, I got you. So I'm going to hit you up if it's not like, you know, because I got to hit up this other guy that's going to be there. Don't want to name any names. Right. But there's a lot of stuff that. But definitely. Let me see. Hand to work, biz. That's what you should be doing. And I'm, I'm going to try to make sure that you know what's going on. Jay Cooley, no war room without me, uh, Bud and his uh, buttercups. Prepare for buttercups. That that's that's a good one. Buttercups. That's almost better than Bud Buddies. Buttercups, bro. That was really good. Uh, <laughs> prepare for a battle, July 29th. Uh, we rolling all y'all up. You ain't rolling shit. You're gonna be chilling, rolling up a damn thing. <laughs> Beers out here balling. <laughs> uh, let me th see. A thousand people in uh at four in the morning. <laughs> It's crazy. Yeah, we're cr listen. Let's say this again. We're crazy. No, no one. I don't care what anyone says. We're crazy. If you're up right now, talking boxing with us, like we're crazy, bro. Anybody who's up, you're crazy. I don't give a damn if you're not in this community right now. You're crazy, bro. <laughs> All right, unless you're in Japan, like <laughs> uh, Texas and see Texas, you're crazy. Let me see. The fade is coming. Man, I don't know. <laughs> no, Butterfingers. No, yeah, all of that, all of that is pretty funny to me. <laughs> all of that is pretty funny to me. Uh, hope they give me the keys. You're a celebrity, bro. I I, I don't, you know what? Let me tell you. I, I well, let me tell you. My biggest celebrity moment I've ever had just happened to me. Maybe two weeks ago, I'm literally driving, right? And I'm in like incognito because I drive around. <laughs> I drive to I drive around in my used vehicle, <laughs> right? <laughs> like I'm not trying to flex with nobody, bro. <laughs> and I'm with Ms. Biz and and my family, and I'm driving. And across on the street at a red light, this brother's like, yo, showbiz. Like in this, he's in his car. And I'm turning the corner. I'm like, this dude saw me. And I'm like, yo, I'm hanging out. Like, what up, dog? <laughs> I'm like, up off, man. He's like, yo. But that dude is over there. He had his top down, though. I think he had it. Yeah, he had a convertible. 
show be I'm like, bro, that's the that was probably the biggest reaction I've ever had to me. Your <laughs> celebrity reaction. <laughs> Cause I'm like, what? That was amazing, bro. Uh, is it early or late? I don't know. I'm up for it. Yeah, I don't, yeah. It's it's early and late, bro. Um, and honestly, to me, I don't feel like a celebrity at all, but I don't really go out like that. So I don't know. I, honestly, from, from my perspective, when I was getting these calls and DMs and stuff like that, like, yo, you're going to be here and all that stuff. That was great to feel because I'm, I'm all, I'm in the house. <laughs> I'm one of those. I'm always in the house, bro. I'm always in the house. <laughs> I'm a stay at home dad. I'm always in the house. Let me see. Flex on them. Seep, 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 pow. King Kong ain't got on me. Let me see. Shout out to the Spider-Man mug and the Dr. Doom statue. <laughs> Way, way in the background. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Um, you know, I'm a huge comic nerd, bro. Huge comic nerd. Showbiz. Where are you from? I'm from Chicago. Where I'm at? I don't, I don't tell. I don't tell anybody. Uh, shout out, please, Paul. Shout out to you. Uh, let me see. I hope uh you get the 200 case up. I had a plan to do to do that, but it fell through. Right. I was going to do like a giveaway and a whole. I still may do that if I get the opportunity to like if i get the opportunity to get this shirt signed by arrow or terrence crawford that'd be funny as shit like let's say terrence crawford beat errol spence and then signed his strap season shirt i'm giving that away like that that i would die laughing or vice versa if errol spence signed his shirt like that i have i'm gonna bring my shirt if they sign it i'm gonna give that away uh let me see um Flex on them. Seep, 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 pow. King Kong ain't got on me. Let me see, Biz. Why do you think that uh, the Flash bombed? Oh, I loved it with the Lord of the Rings uh, references and all. Cried when he had to uh, let go of his mom. It's bo it bombed because we oversaturated, right? Like, I'm just now watching Secret Evasion. The comic stuff is about to go out. It's going to be a sad day when it does, but it can't go on forever. Because let me tell you, these comic book movies cost too much to make. And if you don't spend the money on it, it's easy to see that you're not spending the money on it. But look at how I'm watching Transformers, the new Transformers at the house now. I just watched Flash again. It's out the movie so fast. That's because people can afford to not watch it. And COVID gave people patience to wait for it to get at home. Now there's an expectation for it to be out the movies and be ready for the house. Um, so it's not a big deal. It's just oversaturation. It's oversaturation. So it, 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 it's going to cost too much to make. And people are not going to get as involved as when it was new. And it's, it's about to be done, bro. It's going to be a sad day, though. But it's, it's about to be done. Uh, hopefully, you didn't uh, put money on Fulton, bro. Um, Why? I, I don't know who wins. I don't know. I have no idea who wins. Uh, good morning, everyone. Shout out to uh, all my fellow graveyard workers. Hell yeah, Trevor. Um, now, I don't know who wins this fight. I didn't put money on, on either one because I spent all of my money betting on Errol Spence. I have no more money. In bet us if you want to play place a bet i hope i win so i can start so i can have more but, but bet us on bet us bigger easier to use and safe the link is also in the description box you want you want to put money on the fight that's how you do it but make sure you add showbiz to the, the fight doesn't start for another two hours and 16 minutes the fight doesn't start for another two hours and 16 minutes. I'm here for the long haul, brother. <laughs> let me let me see. Uh, what was awesome? M wait, M17 was pretty good too. What is that? Oppenheimer? What is that, bro? <laughs> 
Don't fall asleep, y'all. No, we we in here. We in here. <laughs> we in here. They not fighting till seven thirty. Whew. We got two hours to chat to chat to chat. Then, but yeah, I'm out of there. I'm I'm done. You better uh get the black two sugars. I got the black two sugars, bro. Uh, undercard, I guess. Yeah, I'll start calling the undercard in a minute. I'm not sure if I can be calling if I can call every undercard. <laughs> right, right now, <laughs> but we could do some talking. Let me see. What y'all mean two hours? Yeah. Oppenheimer. Oh, yeah, that movie. Oh, okay, it was good. Got to check it out. Uh, let me see, Trevor P. Also, bro, Jared Anderson is top five in WBO. Uh, same ranking as Wilder, Ruiz, Sanchez, and AJ. Wow. Sheesh. Uh, I hope he fight one of them. Yeah, it's, it's, it's getting there. It's getting there, brother. It, it's getting there. But they, they are not even done trying to fight each other. Right, they're not the Wilder hasn't fought AJ Ruiz, Tyson Fury hasn't fought AJ Ruiz. They're, they're not Usyk and Wilder hasn't fought, they're not even fighting each other yet, <laughs> <laughs> and that's a shame. Like I said, back in the day, they all would have fought each other multiple times by now. That's why it's very hard for me to say a fighter today is an all time great fighter because of what I'm used to. You cannot. You can't, I can't go for people saying certain fighters are better than fighters I grew up watching when they haven't fought their contemporaries. Showbiz, who's better, Tank or Oscar De La Hoya? Are you shitting me? Are you shitting me? Hey, man, Tank can do, I don't know what Tank can do. See, Oscar, I saw him fight them all. Chavez, Sweet Pete Whitaker, Trinidad, I, he was fighting them all. Sugar Shane Mosley twice, like he was, he's different. Tank, I, I haven't seen these guys against them all. So, you know, when people talk, start talking about Tyson Fury and all-time great, I'm like, has he fought AJ? Has he fought Usyk? Ruiz? Frank Sanchez? Joe Joyce? Zhang? Jared Anderson? I mean, I'm not saying he won't beat them all, but has he fought them? I don't know. Another thing is, when you fight them all, you're not at your best every time. You do get older. You're not in your prime all the time. And that's how you get losses. But then when you have a loss, people say, oh, he lost. So he's not better than this person. Look who he lost to. Because of his wars. So for me, there are people today that's all-time greats, like Canelo Alvarez. I see him fighting everybody. He fights everybody, bro. <laughs> He's only 33. He's younger than Errol Spence. And if you look, there ain't too much fat on his resume, not to me. Compa and co compared to everybody else, ain't even close. So that's why, for me, you, you guys can't be naming these guys, bro, and asking if they're all-time greats. Cheers from uh, social. Uh, I'm up eating chips, but I'm dipping them in water so I don't uh, – uh, wake up, my girl. That is, dog, you're funny as hell. That's funny. Um, that's why, like Roberto Duran, people bring up the no moss, no moss fight. They've seen him at his worst, so then that becomes his staple. They don't know Duran at his best, right? So it's kind of like saying who will win, Tommy Hearns or the Floyd that fought Conor McGregor. It's like that's no fair. So you bring up Duran, no moss. Yeah. Right? It's just ridiculous, bro. Who won? Who will win? The Hearns with the small natural at welterweight or the Floyd that fought Conor McGregor? It's like, that's no fair. Bro. <laughs> Let me see. Uh, how long you uh, been following boxing? Since four years old. Um, Since uh, Ham Show versus Hagler. Uh, Biz, can you help me get my YouTube up and running? Help you get it up? I No. Because I'm so busy trying to get my business going. <laughs> I won't be able to, you know, if you ask me a question, I can give you an answer or best answer I can, but I, I can't coach anybody yet for sure. Let me see. Uh, I think we don't have to wait for two hours more because there's only one more fight until we get to the main event. But it says, it's, it literally said two hours and 16 minutes before the fight. Is Loma a GOAT? Yeah, yeah. He's a... um. 
Loma is an all time great. He's an all, but you got to understand what I mean by all time great. I don't, I don't consider all time great just top 10. You could be top 70, and I'm like, you're an all time great fighter, right? If you look at uh, Timothy Bradley, he's an all time great fighter. He's in the Hall of Fame. Loma is an all time great fighter. He's, he's greater than Timothy Bradley. So, um, yeah, and he's probably the greatest amateur fighter to ever live between him and Mark Breland. So, yeah, he's an all time great. Uh, Biz, will Steph Fulton uh, withstand Inoue's power? Well, you don't, that's not a good, you don't want, you don't want to, you don't want him to. But I don't know. I don't know how Inoue's power transition up, especially Fulton, who can barely make 122. So he's a big man. So I don't know, you know, Figueroa could knock out Fulton. So I don't know how it how it looks. I'm very, very um curious. Fulton fan, uh help my worries. Fulton uh gonna get cracked a lot. You think so? You think so? I don't I don't know, man. Inoue isn't a wilder where where you can avoid him all fight. Uh will his chin hold, you think? I don't think he gets cracked. The point of the fight is the fact that he won't get cracked a lot. You wouldn't think if he does, Inoue, bro, if Inoue is going to be short-lived. Inoue is going to be one, two, pound for pound for the next couple of days. For the next couple of days, he's going to be one, two, pound for pound until the winner of Errol Spence, Terrence Crawford. I mean, that, you know, if, if, if Inoue wins, bro, um, but the point is, Fulton is, is too slick of a fighter for you to just be landing on him all night. Uh, Dimitri Pirog versus Triple G. Man, Triple G. Triple G. <laughs> Triple G, he, he was another GOAT. Uh, let me see. Junto Nakatani versus Bam Rodriguez. What about that? Wait, that's happening? That's happening? Or what do you... Uh, Bam Rodriguez is special, but not all the time. Not all the time. Uh, let me see. Because I've seen him look a kind, kind of normal. <clears throat> Dude, I am sleepy. My brain is not working well at all. Uh, let me see. They are cheap. I want Inoue to be Pac-Man so bad. <laughs> yeah. Two totally different cultures and everything. Uh, Inoue about to give Fulton the coronavirus wrong tong, wrong tong, uh, classic with a bat soup on the side. This dude <laughs> say I'm about to say the most racist shit I can possibly think of. Um, uh, I don't know who wins the fight, bro. Yeah, I'm, I'm not. I'm. It's very difficult because I wouldn't be surprised if Fulton knocked out Inoue. I wouldn't be surprised if he knocked him out. Because Fulton is a sharp puncher who's very big, and Inoue is smaller. I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't be surprised if he knocked him out. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if Inoue knocked out Fulton. I wouldn't be surprised at all. I wouldn't be surprised at all. <laughs> I'm Asian. That was pretty funny. Uh, let me see. Majority decision Inoue. Uh, let me see. Um, Allen. Oh. This is Team Showbiz right here. Uh, comic book movies need more practical effects. Yep, the train sequence in Spider-Man 2 is so well-crafted compared to today's uh, reliance on CGI. Yeah, but let me tell you something, bro. Stuff has to fall apart anyway. Anyway. <laughs> I'm sleepy. Stuff has... Nothing lasts forever. And even Showbiz little adult, even my brand, you know, so I have to make sure I stay reinventing and being innovative the right direction because I can be innovative in the wrong direction. I can't stay the same, right? I, I have to add new elements and new things, and I have to make sure it goes in the right direction. If it goes in the wrong direction, hey, remember when showbiz was like this? I like the old showbiz, not the new showbiz, right? So nothing lasts. Your brand can't just last forever unless you're a genius like Coca-Cola and shit like that. <laughs> Um, so yeah, you eventually to try to make things better, it gets worse. Now, I'm not sure. Well, the Joker, the Joker movies, 
like the the Joker too. I'm I'm pretty sure that's gonna be good. Let me see. I think uh Yakuza told Fulton to lose. The uh, the Yakuza. The, come on, man. Uh, great to see. Is that like a game? Great to see Biz uh go to Terrence Buck Crawford versus ESG. Just worried that Keith Thoyman or Dan Raphael might step uh to him and make the event all about them. Uh, stay safe, Biz. Much. <laughs> What's up with this Dan Raphael thing? Uh, I think Inoue will have difficulty landing shots. I agree because Punch is going to be coming back. Uh, don't uh, lose uh, rest and sleep over the undercard. Bro, this undercard is Inoue by body shot KO. Man, um, Inoue by body shot KO in the eighth. Man, that could happen. That's, that's a very, very uh, wise prediction. Because Fulton had to do so much. Listen, man, I'm leaning towards Inoue because Fulton had two training camps. And I know people call everything excuses now. But if you if if I were to try to find something that makes me say, I think Inoue, uh, other than okay, let's the uh, controversy and uh, um that that I give Inoue the edge is because well, Inoue broke his hand. But I still give the edge to Inoue because Fulton had to stop his training camp. It's hard for him to make 122. I'm looking at him right now. So he had to stop his training camp and restart it. And he didn't look that good at the weigh-in. So he looked a little drained. So I think Inoue going to the body can stop him for sure. For sure. He could pull a Javante Tank Davis and stop him for sure. Uh, Random question. Do you think... I mean, do you use OBS software? Uh, no, I use StreamYard for streams. Keep doing what you do uh, for the community. Thank you so much, brother. I use StreamYard. Um, where are you from, brother? I'm from Chicago, but that's not where I stay now. Let me see. Biz, why are the Japan with those? Why are the in, or why are the in Japan? Man, I don't know what that means with those fights. I'm sorry, brother. I don't know what. Uh, it's not that important. Uh, what's not that important? He didn't LOL drained. He didn't LOL drained? <laughs> what? What's going on? Y'all as tired as I am. Hey, Biz, how come Arrow isn't on Undisputed Boxing Game? Because he he's not. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's like, why isn't Jared Anderson on there or Tank Davis? It's just, that's a lot of money, right? I I, I don't know for sure because um i don't work for them right but you know i'm pretty sure he, there will be dlcs and they will he will be i'm pretty sure right i'm pretty sure they're going to reach out to him and but you got to understand this too at the beginning nobody nobody was responding to undisputed back when they were esbc it's it's great and wonderful to say where are they now but when they this independent company, Steel City Interactive, was trying to make the boxing game and reaching out, they're UK based. Only like small time UK fighters were saying, "Yeah, I want to be in the game." Once it start growing, all of a sudden, why isn't Javante in the game? Why isn't Errol Spence in the game? Why aren't the Charlos in the game? No, 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 because they reached out. A lot, a lot of fighters and managers weren't responding. Then. When Wilder got in the game, Tyson Fury, this guy about to get knocked out. When certain fighters, Terrence Crawford, uh, Sean Porter, oh, that, nah, -uh. nah, see, that's the thing. When you see somebody else getting involved, now you want to get involved. So that's why I'm not tripping that certain people are not in the game yet. Because I know they were reaching out. Right? So I think it's like that. Now, of course, uh, Errol Spence, that'd be great to have him in the game and all these guys in the game. That'd be great. It's just now I think it'd be a DLC thing. Uh, hey, Biz, how come Errol isn't on Undisputed? Uh -huh. Adding Errol would be great for boxing fans. I have Errol winning the fight against TC. I have Errol winning the fight, too, by knockout. Most underrated uh, boxer that is a legend. Most underrated boxer that is a legend. Um... most underrated boxer that is a legend underrated 
most underrated boxer that is a legend. I got to be careful with that because there are people who are, there are fighters who are underrated by the people, but not by those who know, right? So like, um, like Duran is underrated by the people because all they say is no mas, right? Um, Pacquiao can be considered underrated. Um, Sweet P. Whitaker can be considered because Sweet P. Whitaker, there are a lot of guys, a legend. He is a legend. Um, and underrated because you have to say who's a legend. You know who? I'm gonna tell you who. Who's my vote for right now? But y'all are gonna find better names. Um, no, Salvador Sanchez, no. Everybody mentions Salvador Sanchez every live stream I have. It's almost like somebody watched a Salvador Sanchez YouTube documentary or something. Now that's all people bring up. But um, Sonny Liston, because when people think of Sonny Liston, they think of Muhammad Ali beating him. That's it. They don't know Sonny. Sonny Liston is one of the greatest heavyweights to ever live. Sonny Liston, ain't, ain't no beating Sonny Liston, bro. And all they think about is Muhammad Ali beating him. This, this, this shit. The phantom punch and all that. That's all you see on every shirt. Sonny Liston down to him. <laughs> Sonny Liston is known for being sleep. Sonny Liston should not have lost that fight. Like, no one thought. That's how great Muhammad Ali was. No one thought Muhammad Ali would beat him. Sonny Liston, and they thought, and it was like that for a reason. Sonny Liston, right now I'm thinking Sonny Liston, because Sonny Liston can easily be the top 10, one of the greatest heavyweights ever. If you put Sonny Liston in your top 10, it makes sense. Uh, Sanchez versus, Ch well, Sanchez, well, Chavez said Sanchez would win, so I agree with him. Uh, let me see, Wilfred Benitez versus Ezra Charles. Oh, and Ezra Charles, underrated. Wilfred Benitez. Yep. Wilfred Benitez. And when I bring up Wilfred, when I say, I, I, one time I said, I, I don't think Florida be Will. I don't know if Florida be Wilfred. People are like, oh, now you're tripping. They talking about somebody that no one watch. Wilfred. That's another one. Wilfred Benitez, nobody watches him. One of the better fighters ever. <laughs> nobody watches him because Wilfred had the nerve. To exist during Leonard, Duran, Hearns. The funny thing is, he was younger than all of them. It's just that he was a champion since like 15 years old or whatever, 17 years old. He was younger than all of them. See, he beat Duran. Hearns barely got by him in a majority decision. Hearns barely got by him. Let me see. Flex on them. Seep, 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 pow. King Kong ain't got on me. Uh, this fight is close because contrary to common boxing lo logic, uh, Fulton is actually better on the inside than Inoue. I agree. Um, I think Inoue is better mid-range. Fulton also has the physical advantages on the outside too. Yep. Uh, it's the mid-range where Inoue can do damage. Exactly. We're both right there, bro. Right there. Let me see. Uh, Young Pack versus Inoue. See, shit like that. Right? Shit like that, bro. Um, how young of a Pacquiao do you... <laughs> um, I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm going to say Pac-Man. You know, you, get, you can't help but to keep in mind that he became one of the great, arguably top 10 greatest fighters to ever live. Let me see. Parnell Whitaker is my favorite favorite fighter ever. Rocky Marciano may be overrated. Uh, Sam Lankford, yeah, he, he's underrated and underappreciated. The most underappreciated people, ESBC is really uh, Project Boxing in disguise. <laughs> um, Julian Jackson, no, Julian Jackson, everybody talk about him. Um, the most underrated fighters are the fighters of back in the day because people don't, people don't consider it. You know, all the stuff, all the stuff that people talk about today, especially the whole woke stuff. 
that people argue today. It stops at modern times. If you want to talk about how people were mistreated, they don't consider that when I bring up Sam Langford, Jack Johnson, Joe Gans, any of those guys. They don't even, ah, fooey. When shit was really going down, right? Real racism, like really going down. (laughs) Yeah, but then they talk about Fulton. What do you have to go through? (laughs) So when I bring up guys back in the day and not only how good of fighters they were how innovative they were the con but the conditions in which they had to be great in and i say you cannot be greater than him people ah and that's the saddest thing in the world like i'll be like that is incredible <laughs> that's incredible <laughs> let me see uh wilfred benitez had crazy defense some of the best yes lord and guess who taught him customado uh the way you just said that about Sonny Liston not expected uh, to win. You should feel the way uh, that way about Bud. The way you just said that about Sonny Liston is Sonny Liston not expected to win. Sonny Liston not ex- no. Well, Terrence Crawford is the favorite. Wait, I'm not sure. We're, real talk. We, what do you mean? Because Terrence Crawford's the favorite, so I, I don't know. Uh, Aaron Pryor is uh, my dog. Hit the Tyson Bell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, my bad, real talk. I don't know what, what you mean. I said that Sonny Liston, that nobody should have expected um, Muhammad Ali to win. They shouldn't have. Well, actually, they didn't, uh, according to my mother. Oh, April 1st. I, bought, I thought Robisi Ramirez was fighting tonight. Um, my mother was like, nobody thought that little boy was going to win. <laughs> My mom was a teenager herself. She said, when Sonny Liston fought Muhammad, I ain't nobody thought that little boy was going to win. They thought it was, my mom was like, he represented us though. Cause she was a teenager. It was young Muhammad Ali. They all loved him, but they were like that. They ain't no, <laughs> well, I'm saying they grown ass man. Sonny Liston was a killer. <laughs> when Ali won, she was like, what? <laughs> Let me see. Yeah. Uh, they weren't allowed to fight for world championships then. Brother, forget about that. Forget about that. How about not getting water in the corner? How about getting spit on and shit thrown at you on your way to the ring? How about being threatened? How about having a burning cross outside your house? Being threatened that if you win, we're going to hang you from your neck. And you go into the arena and there's not a friendly face in sight and you're the only one sitting there there's not a friendly face in sight in sight you want to talk about going to japan there was nowhere to go just not a friendly face in sight and jack johnson had the nerve to knock out his op and have a have gold teeth and smile at the crowd Do you know how ins- how insane, forget how great that man is? Do you know how great that man is? Bro, when somebody talked to me about greatness, it's hard for me to talk about a lead right hand when this guy is sitting there. Enemy territory is, is everywhere he looked. Not only, if you win, not only will we kill you, but we'll kill your friends and the next brother we see. And he, bam, and dude gets rocked and he grab him and smile at everybody with his gold teeth. Brother, you, I'm sorry. I wouldn't, there's so many people that are fantastic fighters would never be greater than him. I'm, I'm sorry. Let me see. Mayo Griffin and Leonard, Denny Leonard. Griffith, dog, dog. Griffith, shit. Benny Leonard, too, one of the greatest ever. You, you want to talk about innovative. You want to talk about innovative. Uh, let me see. Uh, Willie Pep versus Salvador Sanchez. I got Salvador. I got Salvador Sanchez, dog. I got Salvador Sanchez, dog. Just two too rangy and good 
too rangy and good. Uh, Willie Pep, um, but that sh- I, I think that's a bad matchup. I got Salvador Sanchez, bro. <laughs> Robis Ramirez is the co-feature. That's tonight. That's tonight. You got to be shitting me. Let me see. Uh, that boy was ready to die. Brother, brother, let me tell you. Let me tell you. He was ready to die. Can't, can't, can't. Just, just hear me out. Hear me out. <laughs> hear me out, Johnny. There's people in the crowd. Who recalled owning people? <laughs> it's not funny, but but Jack Johnson's parents, he wasn't that removed from being legally owned. And where does that come from? To be like, bro, do you know how not only how brave you have to be, but how that resonates? With everybody else who's terrified, they're terrified. But they see this guy who ain't scared of shit. But just, do you know what that did forever? Muhammad Ali, Floyd Mayweather, there's none of them without him. What that did, Sugar Ray Robinson, I forget just boxing, entertainment, business, whatever. Do you know what that did? Bruh. 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 <laughs> bruh. Bruh. Michael Jackson, bruh. <laughs> oh, wait for it. Yeah, yeah, everybody. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let, let me give that mic. Let me give that mic. Let me give that mic. Everything is worth this thing to me. <laughs> thank, thank you, Jack Johnson. Yeah. <laughs> me? <laughs> That's why nobody can tell me shit. Hey, showbiz, we need to, man, what? brother, I'm getting mine. <laughs> I'm getting mine, bro. <laughs> Let me see. Rain walking that. Uh, yeah, yeah. Finito Lopez. <laughs> yeah, Sandy Sadler. <laughs> um, Let me see. Two hours to the fight. Yeah, it's, 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 it's crazy, bro. That's the black two sugars. Uh, you see KSI versus Tommy Fury confirmed the other day? No, I didn't see it. I, I th- the last thing I heard was that they weren't going to fight. So they're gonna fight. You know, KSI may beat him, man. Tommy Fury, you know, KS, I, I prefer KSI to beat him because KSI fights in a way that is pathetic, <laughs> but it's so savage that it's effective. I would, I would love. For KSI to, to knock him out. That would be, I mean, I'll be like, yo, he would look scary at that point. Uh, let me see. Plus 60 on the draw, Spence versus Bud, Discord link, champ. Hey, somebody put the link f- to the Discord. Uh, freak, add the link to the Discord. Yeah, I would bet on the draw. <laughs> that that draw, I'll bet on the draw. Bomac or Butterbean? Butterbean, dog. In every sense, who's who? I, I, whatever comparison you want, I got Butterbean. Uh, I don't even care if it's not boxing, whatever Butterbean. I didn't know that uh, people would talk about, should talk about that. I didn't know that people should talk about that. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 they should talk about it, bro. Listen, man, his, they, his record, they removed 80 fights. They, they removed 80 wins off of his record. Let me tell you. Look at Sam Langford. If you box wreck Sam Langford, look at look at how many draws he got. Look at how many draws he got. Hey yo, Sam Langford would knock a guy out and they'd call it a draw. That's why you know, I'll bring up Sam Langford and Floyd and they say but Floyd was undefeated. I'm like, y'all sound, y'all don't know how ignorant y'all sound. Y'all don't know how ignorant y'all sound. Sam Lankford had knocked a guy out and they had called it a draw. How would he think his losses? If a, if a guy is still standing, Sam Lankford lost. Bro. 
that they had a time. Yeah, they removed 80 wins at least. Look it up. Look, read up on Jack Johnson. They removed 80 wins. He'll fight when and they won't record it. Look it up. Read about it, bro. It'll put a lump in your throat. You'll be ready to cry. <laughs> Let me see. Yo, Biz, you got a new member joining the war room. Any advice on becoming a dad? No advice. Let me tell you why. Because as soon as your baby born, bro, I I'll be shocked if your baby was born. When your baby's born, it's going to be innate. Soon as that baby come out, I know what happened to me. I, I didn't know what it would take. I, I remember my mom told me, I, I said, man, I'm not sure if I'm ready to be a parent. She said, when your baby's born, you're going to be ready. It's instinctual. Soon as your baby's born, everything you are, they're showing the hand wraps. <laughs> oh, he's not stacking. <laughs> they're showing, they're showing he knew a, oh no, he did. Oh no, he didn't. He's not stacking dog. So they put the tape. Hold on. He knew he laughing. They gave it a normal rap, and he knew he's laughing. <laughs> hey, they wrapped his hand normally. Oh shit! If he knew he knocks him out, this is gonna be funny. This is gonna be funny. If he knew he knocks him out, this is gonna be funny as shit. Now he can legally stack in Japan. He wrapped it a regular way. They like this. Is how you want to do it? However you want to do it. Oh, that's beautiful. That. <laughs> People like, why don't he do it the normal way? If he that <laughs> like, hey, let he do it. Hey, they keep looking at the coach. They put the phone on him. They keep looking at the coach. Like, is this how you want it? Look at he do it, smiling at him. This is how you want it. <laughs> Bruce Leroy or Bruce Lee. Brother Bruce Leroy got the glow, dog. Bruh. Liston versus Foreman. I don't know. Uh Bardios versus Taylor. I don't know. Loma versus Tank. I don't know. <laughs> I think I got Tank. I got Tank right now. Right now I got Tank. Yo, yo, I love that they were laughing. I love that they were smiling. If, if, hey, bro, if he knew he knocks him out, I, let me tell you what I love about this. It's hard for me to go up against Cool Boy, though. I love Cool Boy. Cool Boy is, I, I, I fell in love with Cool Boy once. He beat Figueroa. Well, I thought Figueroa won the fight. I did. I, I did. But still, how he fought Figueroa, I was like, that guy's all right with me. That's that Philly tough. So it's hard for me to root against him. But, but I love this because people leading up to the, before the fight ever happened, he knew he wouldn't fight Cool Boy, though. He wouldn't fight Fulton, fighting Fulton. Now, he's cheating. Ah! Ah! How, how, how do you want me to wrap my hands? That's a gladiator, bro. So is Fulton for fighting in Japan. Like I said, this is the sad part. Sully. Sully. Hold on, Sully. Hold on, Sully. Is worth it to me. This is the sad part. 24 minutes till Coleman. Good. This is the sad part. The 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 sad part is Fulton and Inoue, it wasn't them. It's everybody else. It's everybody else perverting this fight for their own personal interest to get to the bag. We saw it happen with Tyson Fury and Wilder. Same shit. All it is is to get to the bag. It actually didn't matter. It didn't matter. The professionals are telling you it doesn't matter. That's why it's legal. It doesn't matter. But Timothy Bradley, beautiful way by top rank to have Timothy Bradley sell this fight. It's called stacking. Ten times more power. Controversy sells the fight. I'm a businessman. I looked at that and died laughing. I looked at that and died laughing. My video, I laugh because my video Got 50,000 views in one day. <laughs> I said, oh, y'all got me to the bag and everything. I'm not against me getting to the bag. I'm going to tell the truth, though. But I'm not going to be against y'all getting me to the bag. 
brother, y'all keep falling for the same shit. <laughs> oh, yeah, uh, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. So tonight, gotta leave the nine to five up on the shelf. What was the issue anyways? Correct me if I'm wrong, but stacking doesn't actually have any effect on power, right? Yeah, it's legal. It's legal. It's legal, bro. It's legal. It's all a business model. Yeah. Yeah, go ahead, Sully. Sully! For, Fulton need to prove his... Fulton, bro, that's facts. That's why Fulton was like... Fulton knew. But Fulton is so real, the bad thing is Fulton's getting a bad rap. Like I said, they made him look weak. Fulton's so real. He, that wasn't him. He was like, man. That's the saddest thing. Like I said, the fighters is a sad thing. But they knew because let me tell you what else they leveraged. Japan being foreign for us in the States. Well, they must be doing something sneaky over there. <laughs> right? Racial insecurities. Because you haven't really seen a black man go to Japan. He's going to get cheated. You tap dance on everybody's insecurities. And you create a controversy. They race is a business. They've been using that forever. I'm looking at this dying. I, and I told you guys. Tim Butler. When I brought up Jack Johnson smiling at the crowd with gold teeth. Let me tell you what Jack Johnson knew, that he's big business. He knew he was so ahead of his time. He knew he was big business. No matter how much they hate me, they're going to make money off the hate of the people. It's a sold out crowd every time. That's why he lived. That's why he survived. Uh, talking about Devin Haney trying to, uh, fighting around Ramadan for weight uh, reasons. Fulton says he prefers fighting during Ramadan. He is uh, actually insane. Fulton ain't playing no games. <laughs> LOL, just woke up to this. You're the GOAT. Bro, bro, bro. I knew exactly what was going on. And I looked at my comments and said, look, I... There were so many Elijah Muhammad Ali <laughs> float like a butterfly, st sting like Abby <laughs> in my comments. Brother, what we need to do is, and I'm like, Timothy Bradley sat there and, and got to the bag, got everybody to the bag. Thanks, Tim. <laughs> Timothy! <laughs> Woo! I'm not sure if I should be saying this, but I'm going to keep it a buck. Timothy! Timothy, boom, by yay. As soon as he said, you can't do that. And my man said, is it legal? Oh, no. He said, "You are you saying that Inoue is a cheater? I can't do that. I can't say that because he's a new. No, I'm not saying he's cheating. Is it legal? It's legal, but is it legal? You can't do that. It's like, bro. Bradley, boom, by yay. Bradley. Everybody got to the bag. And that's the black. I love it when you preach biz. Yeah, because y'all said, man, it's, it's 2,200 people in here on a Tuesday morning. This is a great fight, but it's at a wrong time. How do we get people to watch this fight? Controversy. And let's tap dance on their insecurities. And then, and then the coach in there with the phone and got everybody like, yeah, got him now. Got him now. He was always going to be there. <laughs> That's the black tool, sugars. <laughs> you right. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Fresh off the clock, Bill. <laughs> Car started. Okay, bro. <laughs> Car started. Yeah. Yeah. We'll, we'll start calling the fights in a minute. <laughs> we'll start. It's boxing is a business. Boxing is a business. Preach, brother. <laughs> the preacher, Bill. Uh, 
brother. Ha! <laughs> ha! <laughs> Certain fights. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, you want to know something that's funny? You want to know something? <laughs> hey, you want to know something that's funny? Tonight is a hardcore fans night. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Where's your towel, Ben? Tell me. You saw me bring that out. <laughs> Alex. Hey, y'all want to know something that's really funny? We need a, a talking uh, show biz plush. L listen, listen. Killing is a business for the stupid. Hey, hey, let me, let me tell you something that's really funny. They show, they showed Inoue's, uh, torn, uh, <laughs> hey, yo, y'all be falling for, not y'all, but people be falling for some shit. They showed Inoue's torn, uh, where the boxing glove in a package. <laughs> As if, as if that was an accident and they got busted. Or <laughs> as if you don't check the gloves anyway. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. And here's the funny thing. Let me hear. Are you high? Am I high, dog? Look how early it is in the morning. I'm just sleepy. And let me and let me tell you this. Let me tell you this. But but nobody. They brought up some. They brought up the torn package, right? The rip package. Did anyone see Bud Crawford's boxing gloves against David Evanesian? His gloves look like he fed them to his pit bull, bro. <laughs> his whole glove. That nobody's thinking about that. Nobody, nobody's thinking about it. <laughs> right? Nobody's calling Glove Gate for Terrence Crawford versus Errol Spence. Nobody's none of that shit. You don't need that to sell that fight. Nobody bringing up. You better check Bud Crawford's glove. He's known for cheating. Look at his gloves versus Evanesian. You don't you can't do that because there is no insecurities there. There is it's two black guys. There's no insecurities there. So you don't have to do that. If you do that, it doesn't help the fight. It takes away from it. So, you know, no one brings up there must be a glove conspiracy. A torn package. <laughs> Bro, 100%. If, if y'all don't obviously see the damn play, <laughs> and I just sit here and be like, all right, dog. All right. I'll be called every name in a book. I'm like, all right, bro. I hear you, bro. Let me see. Man, it's 5 a.m. and I'm up dancing to James Brown. Good. Good. Crafty rights. Those are facts. Yep. <laughs> yep. 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 But a but a slit in the package. Ah! Ah! <laughs> All right. All right. All right. Hey, let me ask you this. Let's say, let's say Bud Crawford was a white guy and about to fight Errol Spence. Do y'all think there would be a glove gate situation? Let me just ask. And let's just say if if it was a white guy who last fight was David Evanesian and his gloves looked like that, do you think they would have used that to market the fight against Errol Spence? What do you think? You think that would have been a big part of the marketing? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. That would have been all over the place. Sam Langford slaps up Floyd. Uh, don't at me, you bums. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, hey, yeah. Yes, Lord. A hundred percent. So. And let me tell you, which is why Fulton looked at his boy and said, 
Fulton is too real. Cool boy is too real. That's why I was in my videos, I was doing whatever it took to be like, it's no fair. Any negative reactions towards Fulton is no fair. Or Inoue. Both of them. No fair. No fair. And that's the black two sugars. Let me see. Dog, if Inoue wins by KO, yo, yo, I'm 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 gonna giggle. I'm going to giggle. I'm going to giggle. I, I cannot help it. I'm going to giggle. Fulton is my guy. It's going to sting, but I will giggle, though. <laughs> Let me see. What network is a fight on? ESPN Plus. Uh, I think Spence Camp loses it, uses it if they lose. I don't think so. That ain't Spence. Bruh. Spence has never brought up the rehydration clause being the reason why he could knock out Mikey Garcia. Garcia, He never brought it up. He doesn't bring that shit up. Spence never brings stuff like that up. He just fights. Mm -mm. Biz, you're up early. The fight's early. <laughs> I'm hollering. Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. Bruh, Tim. Tim. People don't know what woke is. <laughs> What's really being awake. People don't. No, what woke is, bro. <laughs> Let me see. It's all a business, dog. Let me see. It's 50 50, uh, but I'm going for Inoue. Um, it's, I don't know, man. It's very hard for me to who I'm going for. Like, who look, Fulton, st listen, man. Okay, let me tell you. Fulton, it's like Spence versus Crawford. Spence stayed around 147, didn't fight Keith one time. So he can stick around and make this fight happen with Terrence Crawford. Cool boy. <laughs> that dude should have been left. <laughs> he should have been. He was on his way out of 122. He was gone. But he stayed for Inoue and then went to Japan to fight him on a Tuesday morning. Bruh, it's very difficult to go against Cool Boy. <laughs> All right? I'm sorry. But at the same time, Inoue moves up. Everyone says he won't fight Fulton. He didn't even get a tune-up. He goes straight to Fulton, the best in the division. It's hard not to root for a new way. I'm sitting here just happy that we got the fight. <laughs> I'm brother, I've I've never been more. I don't care who wins in my life. <laughs> I love both of these brothers, man. Let me see. Good morning, my guy. When we play undisputed. Shit, I gotta get back. I mean, I every time I play, I get my ass whipped now. I, something changed. I'm getting my ass whipped. I'm going to the store, scorecards like, damn, I used to win this way. Maybe it's the magnitude of the fight in a foreign land that has Fulton Camp worked up. David, it, they're not worked up. David, <laughs> they're purposely getting to the bag. David, David, all you need to do, why do you think Captain America Superman and Wonder Woman are iconic comic book characters. Why, David? Have you ever have you seen the the covers of their comics fighting the Japanese with big teeth and the real racist shit and fighting Hitler and all? There from that moment on, there has been a stigma attached to especially Germany, Japanese, and all those things, if you want to sell something, again, brother, you already know where I'm going. You bring up cheating and fear, and that's what you do. So now you go into this foreign land. That's how you sell it. I'm not, I'm not going to keep talking about this <laughs> because I think it's against the business of boxing. And I'm for the business of boxing because I get paid from it. Right? 
So if that gets business to back, <laughs> let me see. Early morning, crusty eye gang. We hear, yeah, breath smell is stinking. You got a thick saliva. <laughs> let me see. How many hours till it start? Uh, it starts in a minute. It starts in a minute, bro. I think I, I can't help but to be truthful, but I think I should stop. <laughs> let me see. <laughs> Uh, Cap has like the worst superpower ever, to be honest. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but he's still my favorite because <laughs> he's so human. He's peak human, right? He's the he's the peak of where a human can be physically. I always thought that was dope. But then he can go to stand toe to toe against Thanos. It's like so he has like heart. It's like it's crazy. Uh, let me see. He's brave. Uh, let me see. I'm going to be working. Uh, keep posted. I will, bro. They they're showing they're showing Onito Donnell versus the new A2 right now, bro. Let me see. Uh, yeah. When he whip when he whip Nonito Donaire, I said this this guy how bad he beat him the second fight. I said this this guy. <laughs> you are a natural uh entertaining speaker. Thanks, brother. And, and let let me tell you something. <laughs> I get it. It's natural because I'm not trying to be entertaining, dog. I mean, every word I say. Uh, let me see. Yeah, he can wield Thor's hammer, bro, out of just being worthy. Um, Fulton will win. Mark my words. Okay, we'll mark him, bro. It doesn't matter. I'm missing a cool 1,500 likes. Yeah, everybody hit the like. Hit the like. We're up in the morning. You can do that this time. I know, I know y'all stingy with the, I don't know what y'all stingy as shit doing this. That I yo, this right here is like the hardest thing in the world. I don't ask for money. I barely ask for y'all to subscribe. But this, I all I ask is hit the like. And y'all can't do it. Can't. Let me see. Uh two dollars. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> enjoy the fights guy i feel so this has to be the saddest comment he meant it to be happy but this a tear almost dropped because he ain't going to be able to see the fight he said enjoy the fight guys think think about me <laughs> on the low <laughs> think about me <laughs> let me see love you bro love you boy <laughs> oh bro you my favorite youtuber <laughs> thanks <laughs> thank you brother thank you brother oh Showbiz, what's your opinion on Haney possibly taking on Regis Progre instead of Sugar Shakur Stevenson? Mm, it makes sense because um, Sugar Shakur was absolutely right. It, it was, he can't, I, I would have been shocked if Devin Haney would have fought Sugar Shakur Stevenson in the, in the condition he's in when he fights at 135. You know, so um, I figured he was going to go up. And I figured that fight wasn't ready yet. You know, um, um, he can't healthy in a healthy 100% way make 135. And Sugar Shakur knows that. That's why he's not mad at it. I think Devin Haney fighting Regis Progre, if you're going to go to 140, shit, that's better than Tank fighting Barrios. No, Devin Haney, bro. Hey, no matter how y'all feel about Devin Haney, bro. That dude got some integrity for your ass. He got integrity for your ass. Now, do I think he won the Loma fight? No, I don't. But he didn't judge it. He fought the fight. Him? He got integrity for your ass. He does. He fought Cambosis in Australia twice, became undisputed, dropped the franchise title like he said he was going to do, Um, defended it against Lomachenko, then going to fight Regis Progre. Thank you so much for the super chat. That brother there, I, I don't care what anybody says, and he can't punch through a wet paper bag, so why is he so confident? Dude, uh, this is a weird event. Uh, just show the fight. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, I, I like I like Haney versus Progray. As an American, we should go for the American, right? Uh, no, no one should. No, no, no. Um, no one should tell me in my life what I should do. Kiss my ass. And I've, I've, I've had that chip my whole life. Showbiz, you shouldn't quit your job and go to YouTube. Man, kiss my ass. 
Like my whole, you got one life to live. Do what makes you feel good. If you don't like this person, but like that person, do you, bro. Forget should. I'm not about that. <laughs> Never been. We should. We have to. I ain't got to do shit for who? You? Man, do you. Do you. I don't care. If y'all, you don't want to root for Fulton, don't. If you in Japan and you want to root for Fulton instead of Inoue, do that. I don't, I ain't got that kind of time. Do it. We should. Man, do you. Uh Andy Cruz uh going to take over one take over 35. You think he's gonna beat Shakur and tanking him? Man, shit. Chill biz this morning. No. <laughs> that was a dumb comment. You feel me, Tim? I ain't got that kind of time. For me, life is so fragile, bruh. Robesi is next. Well, I'll be damned. <laughs> this is crazy as hell. Oh, let me see. Life is way too fragile for me. You look back and be like, why was I on that? <laughs> let me see. Yeah, that comment was dumb. Yeah, let, let, let's go ahead. Let's, let's go ahead and give it to him, dog. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and give it to him. Let's go ahead and give it to him. That comment was dumb. Let me see. Good point. A promo, to be honest. I didn't give it much thought. This fight is close. Fulton has to be able to hurt him, uh, give respect early. Yeah, and I think he can. David, I must be one of the very few that think Fulton can knock out Inoue. I'm one of the very few. I I don't, I, I see that big man throwing those sharp, fast shots. I don't care what anyone says. I don't care his knockout ratio or anything like that. I think he can. He knew he better not come in thinking that he can't be hurt by, by Fulton. Thank you so much, my brother. Uh, he knew a legs would be the different difference maker. Yeah. Yeah, if, there, if there's anything. Americans are most likely not to support the home team. I don't know that either. I don't know what all Americans do, Malik. I have no idea. When I see, when I think of America, I think of, you know, land of the free, home of the brave, patriotic. <laughs> like, I, I see patriotism. But I, I, don't, I don't care about speaking for everybody, man. <laughs> I don't care. I could, I'm only in control of me. So I root for boxing. I ain't got that kind of time. I ain't got, I, I don't, you shouldn't root for boxing. You should root for this type of people because they're like you and shit. Like, I ain't got that kind of time. I, I'm not that egocentric. I ain't got that kind of time, bro. Let me see. Black to August. Yeah. Yeah. Depends uh, on what kind of fight Fulton brings. Facts. Facts. Only for the World Cup for me. Oh, that's a good point. That's a good point. Um, um, I root for people I can identify, right? So I used to root for Usain Bolt. <laughs> I knew him, right? At, at the, there, in the Olympics, you know, the, you know, all these, I was looking at Usain Bolt. And <laughs> he ain't American at all. Like, I, I used to look at him like, damn, dog, I hope he get another one in. I, I just wanted to see greatness, bro. You know, so I mean, I probably it was the Olympics. I guess I should have rooted for the Americans, right? They're all black too. So I, but I was looking at Usain Bolt, bro. <laughs> so for me, maybe you could call me not patriotic. You can call me what you want, right? I was rooting for Michael Phelps though. So let me see. Um, a fan of greatness. Yeah, that's what I'm on, dog. <laughs> But that's me. And then people are going to judge me, but I'm not yours, right? You don't own me. I don't give a shit. You know what I mean? Let me see. Wow. Thank you so much. I don't know what that is, but thank you. That looks like a lot, but it may be 50 cents. I have no idea how that, but thank you, bro. It's a lot. I Just for you to give that, thank you so much. Hit the Tyson bell. A traitor to your people. Well, explain how ESPN owns you. Dang, now ESPN owns me? 
I was just PPC. Well, y'all figured it out. Listen, I'm going to tell you, to this comment, I want to say this. I'm just looking forward to when people say I'm a clone. That's when I know I've made it, right? I'm already getting, you know, I'm a part of the elite. Uh, PPC owns me now. ESPN owns me. Bro, I'm almost there. I need for y'all to call me a clone. Once I'm a clone, I'm, I know I've made it. <laughs> I need that clone type of money, bro. Let me see. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Trade it to your people. How am I a trader to my people? How am I a trader to my people? Please explain. <laughs> I need for him to explain. I need for him to explain. Uh, good, good early morning, show biz. Much love, my brother. Much love to you. How you doing this morning, dog? How you doing this morning? Well, I, I'm gonna tell you this. <laughs> Come on, keep doing you biz, bro. I'm gonna tell you this. People be bugging. Yeah, I bet you, Fulton, because he's talking about my black people. I bet you, Fulton, appreciate me being up early in the morning, bringing awareness to this fight, though. I bet you that. I bet you that I have something to do with the the videos I've done talking about it may have made people a little bit more excited about watching this fight. I'm pretty sure making comments isn't more valuable than what I'm doing right now for Fulton. I bet you that. So people don't know what support is. This man said traitor to my people and I'm wearing an Errol Spence drop season shirt that I bought. And I'm and I'm a billboard in front of 2,700 people for Errol Spence right now. This guy don't know what support is. That whole ass chicken George ass support where you just talk, that is not a progressive support. Put your money where your mouth is. All right, hit the Tyson bell. Put some effort where your mouth is. Dudes don't know what support is. Uh, let me see. Uh, show bills the clone. There, there you go. Once I'm a clone, bro. <laughs> Super sticker. Thank you so much. Uh oh, flex on him. Seep, 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 pow. King Kong ain't got on me. Let me see. Had a dream that Spence got caught with the mean hook, <laughs> and he got dropped, and Bud kept hitting him while he was down. Damn. And he couldn't get up, and the ref didn't stop. Damn, you felt he got his ass whipped. <laughs> uh, Spence was punch drunk. He couldn't get up, and the fight was over. Damn, dog. <laughs> That's <laughs> get him, Biz. <laughs> Brother, th these dudes, these little new, these little chicken George supportive cats. Let me see. It's your boy, Biz. Ohio. Die. Much lo love you, boy. Love you, boy. Thank you so much. Let me see. Uh, look, this is a great year of boxing. Yep, the sport has uh needed. I'm excited. Uh, Fulton uh took this fight. I'm excited. Ful Fulton took the fight too. Um, uh, Showbiz, the Marvin Hagler clone. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm the Marvin Hagler clone. Here we go. Big fish for a reason. Uh huh. What's up with the two sugars, Biz? Much love, my brother. I got, I got my, I got my, my Joseph Parker right here. Oh my goodness. Um, our people equal our family plus our friends. Well, all of you guys is my my people. All of you guys, my people. All of you guys, my people, man, like genuinely, directly, we're we're for each other. We're all here. We're all here. Well, that was dark, <laughs> brother, brother. I, I, I got to I got to wake some people up here. Uh, when there are 700 people in here, we were talking about Sandy Sadler and Sonny Liston. Now, two point K uh, in here and it sounded moist. Yeah, well. that That's what it is. Trolling, being negative, being nasty, you know. Fulton about to take uh you're right though. When there were 700 people in here, we were talking about Sonny List and Willie Pep. See, that was a great point. Let, let me let me give you a love. Let me give you a love. Cause check this out. Let me give you a love.
Let me tell you why that was a great point. Because I just brought up, you can get to a point where we want the old showbiz. So if this, when this channel gets super big, I don't want to lose sight of Sonny Liston, Willie Pep, <laughs> Benny Leonard, Sam Langford, uh, Harry Grab, <laughs> Joe Lewis. Uh, new member, baby, baby. Excellent point. Let me see. Going to show some support after uh, your speech. Thanks, my brother. Thank you, my brother. Uh, who wakes up with that much hate in their heart? Brother, if, if you saw where he woke up, you'll have hate too, dog. Let me see. <laughs> you angry at breakfast, brother. He got breakfast, bro. That dude, that dude got he got he got a a, a couple handfuls of of fruit rounds or fruit rings or fruit dots. Not the real shit. He got cocoa dots or something. <laughs> no milk. He just <laughs> he got a couple hand uh you that angry he got a couple handful of cocoa dots and a cup of water. Uh, you that hangry at grits and bacon. We got to be better towards each other. Shake my head. Uh, have a better day, showbiz uh, partners. Much love. Yeah, brother. No, we are good, brother. We are good. We are good. We are good. <laughs> we are good. Um, here, Robisi right here. Let me tell you something about Robisi Ramirez. Let me tell you something about Robisi Ramirez, bro. <laughs> Robisi... <laughs> Robisi Ramirez, I remember when he lost his very first fight and people said he was overrated. And I said, chill, because B-Hop lost his first fight. Um, Henry Armstrong lost his first three fights. Remember, it, it, my day was remember that, BK. Love you, boy, because I, re I recall BK making a comment about it. I said, chill, chill. I said uh, Lomachenko lost like his second fight. Chill. Sometimes when you, you're not everybody can be Andy Cruz, right? Sometimes when you come directly from amateurs over, it takes a qu quick second to adjust. Sometimes when you have fought to be a great amateur, I said, chill. Sure as shit. <laughs> sure as shit, dog. People got to stop worrying about that. Oh, I'm saying, bro. I'm saying I lost a fight in my dreams. I haven't lost a fight in a dream in a minute. I'm always whipping ass in my dreams. In real life, maybe something different. The co-main event is starting now. Yeah, yeah, this is it. Yeah, we, we just brought up Robisa Ramirez right there. Oh, let me see. Great point. Yeah, Tim. Yeah, Tim. Uh, one loss does define a career. No, no. It's not, it's not how many times you get knocked down, it's how many times you get up and how you get up and what fashion you get up. You can just get up or you can get up. Oh, let me see. Where's the fight? Japan. Oh, ESPN Plus. Is there any fight or just talking? Yeah, but they're not fighting right now. They're standing here. So we got to wait for the fight to start and then we start talking about what's going on. Oh, uh, let me see. Um... Hi, Biz. I'm from Singapore, so the only way I can hear the fight today is through your live. Bet. Stream. Keep it up uh, when the comment. I got you. I got you. Hit the Tyson bit. Ryan, for example. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Predictions. Pain. Bro, I have. I cannot call it. Inoue versus Fulton, I can't call. It's such a bizarre matchup. I can't. I really can't call it, bro. I, I'm going to keep it real. I cannot call it, bro. I cannot call it. Um, do I think Mike Tyson was overrated? No. Actually, I think he's top 10 greatest heavyweight of all time. Uh, I think he's underrated because people don't know his resume. So they think he didn't fight anybody. So nowadays, you know, with there, there are these new Mike Tyson fans who didn't watch Mike Tyson and didn't know. They probably saw Mike Tyson older or... They saw footage of him, but they didn't know the environment. They didn't know how great these other fighters were how and what he actually accomplished. So now they call him over, overrated, right? Um, saying that the only fight, real fighters he fought, he lost to and all that shit. So Mike Tyson is one of the greatest fighters to ever live. He is. He's not overrated. He's, now he's underrated. 
now he's underrated. He did great things. He wasn't just he wasn't just fantastic at 19, right? With Customato. That guy, that guy is something else. Mike Tyson special. And there was a minute where I was thinking similar to that. There was uh some years back. But after studying his career again, that guy was great, bro. Mike Tyson is one of the best ever. He's he's underrated now. Um small man will destroy giants, but but Olympic gold medalist too. Olympic gold medalist. Yo, the 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 worst thing that Robisi just got announced. Last point I'm gonna make about Mike Tyson is one of the things that really suck is people throw away his fights with Spinks and Larry Holmes. They throw that away, and that's and that suck because that's a huge part of his greatness. Larry Holmes, when he fought Mike Tyson, Larry Holmes only lost to one man, and that was Spinks. Mike Tyson beat Larry Holmes and Spinks. People, people don't do that now. They don't do that now. That's that's like if that's like that's like if Jared Anderson were to beat Tyson Fury and Usyk. That's what that's like. Tyson Fury is 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 long in the tooth now. Let's say Jared Anderson beat Wilder and Usyk. That's what that's like. That's what that's like. Oh, uh, let me see. How how does it make you feel to hear that people are listening to you in Singapore? Um, amazing every time. It makes me feel great that people are listening to me from down the street. That, I, yo, it just makes me feel great that people are just. What is going on with my shit? What just happened? Uh, young Holmes or Young Tyson? Who wins? Young Tyson, dude. I think Tyson's bad for Holmes. Did, is everything okay? All right, here we go. Now, why would BC Ramirez just lean on the ropes like that? Hey man, Shimizu is tall than a mug. He's old, but he's tall as hell. Shooting a jab, two south paws. BC shit jab to the body. Dog, look how look a uh, one two from Shimizu. Hey, hey, let me tell you something. Why Shimizu standing so tall? His foundation looks bad. Ramirez is like, this is bad. Look at how slow Shimizu is. Look how he drops his hand after he. Th uh, this is this. Come Who put this man in the ring with with Ramirez? Who did that shit? Ramirez knows what's up already. Oh, all right. All right, this is just a showcase. Just to keep just to keep the blood flowing. A one two from Shimizu. Hey dog. Good double jab from Ramirez. Who uh, he Ramirez threw a punch at his guard and almost knocked him out the ring. Little jab from Shimizu. They scream. Oh yeah. The home, the home, the home advantage. Good combination from Ramirez. They scream. Dog, Shimizu missed the left. And they were like, whoa! Yeah. Oh, they screaming like a oh, good uppercut from see. I think Ramirez knows. Like, hey, hey, I'm I'm oh, good uppercut from Ramirez. Good hook. Ramirez can knock. Oh, good uppercut, right hook. Ramirez can knock him out right now. He just he heard the screams from the crowd and said. I can't play around because they give him, they give him some <laughs> one minute, five seconds. Yo, that lets me know, Fulton, when, if you can land three punches, land three. Don't just land one, bro. Land three. Because the crowd, not the judges so much right now, but the crowd. Oh, good jab from Ramirez. The crowd can affect the judges. They're screaming like, whoa! Look, one, two, all blocked from Ramirez. Ramirez threw, threw a nice little body shot. 30 seconds. Oh, good uppercut. Right hook from Ramirez. Hey, hey, Shamiju. Let me, let me, let me get, let me, let me give you a golden, bro. Stop trying to fight on the inside and trying to walk. They can't help it. 
they can't help it. That's the culture. They they they're gonna slug. 18 seconds left in the first round. They're gonna slug, bro. He's he's trying to walk Ramirez down. Good thing for Ramirez. Good job. Shit. Ramirez is just high guard catch and shooting. At the, oh, good hook, good hook again from Ramirez. Ramirez laughing his ass off. Yeah, he 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 won that round, but we'll we'll see, we'll see. Um, uh, only man that ever stopped Holmes was Mike Tyson. That's a good stat. Uh, just wanted to say uh thanks to all uh you do for the fight community. You're the man and deserve your fight. Thank you so much, Ace Hitch Tyson. Man. Uh, let me see. Uh, I get that uh, they're in Japan, but how are you going to name the champion first and contender last? Um, it happened with Bilbo and Canelo, right? So um, they weren't even in Mexico when they did that to, to Bilbo. I don't, they, they be on that, bro. They be on that. I don't know. I don't know. Let me see. Flex on them. Seep, seep, seep. See, left hand on you. Left hand on you. Pow. King Kong ain't got on me. Let me see. Greetings from San Francisco, showbiz. You the man. I've been watching all your YouTube videos last three weeks. Keep it up. So excited for a new A410. Let's go, my man. Thank you so much, brother, for the super chat. That was amazing. Thank you so much. All right, here we go. Second round. Up. Oh, good combination from Ramirez. See, Ramirez will throw a 2-1 like, like no, bi no, no biggie. I wonder if he's naturally a southpaw. He may write right-handed to tell you the truth a lot of people do that they they box oh good counter left ramirez said let me get this guy out of here bro. good footwork from ramirez good head movement upper upper body movement good jab oh good uppercut oh shit he threw a left uppercut and left hook natural as hell oh the the punch selection hey man let me tell you something about shimizu oh shimizu said that hurt he <laughs> And look, Ramirez fainted, and Shimizu, he covered up as if he was about to get a whooping by, with a belt. Let me tell you something about his chin, though. Pretty solid. He's a tough guy. He's a tough guy. Older, though. He's long in the tooth. What is he, like 37? Long in the tooth. <sighs> hey, I'm going to tell you, man, he got some decent reflexes, though. Shimizu, the way he's standing looked like he's about to get slapped. But he's ducking some stuff. Like he, Oh, good left to the body. Ramirez is really breaking him down, though. I, I can't see Shimizu lasting, you know, five rounds. Hey, I think I think Ramirez needs to counter the jab a little bit more because Shimizu is throwing one jab at a good good jab from Ramirez. He's throwing one jab at a time. Oh, good one two from oh, good counter left from that's the counter jab. He countered the jab with the left, overhand left. That's what I was talking about. Just countered that jab for me. Oh, good hooks to the head from Ramirez. They both in the center of the ring. Good jab from Shamiz. Shamiz was saying, let me get my Ali on, dog. He's, he's hopping around like, let me get my Ali together. One minute left in the, in the second round. You know, he's bouncing on his toes like, let me get my Ali together, dog. You got to counter that jab, Ramirez. He's going to do that all night. He sh sh just... Look, look, this guy think he's cash as clay, bro. Shimizu shooting a jab like he's cash as. <laughs> oh, I mean, Ramirez blocking it all, but if you throw some, some hammer back, you know, pause. If you throw some fire back, you, you may, if you could take that jab away, it wouldn't be bad. Oh, good look to the body. Ha! Good left from Shimizu. Ha! Good left to the body from Ramirez. Ah, good, oh, oh, good combination from Ramirez. Brother, he he dog Shimizu is he dog that dude got the most Larry Holmes jab right now. He ain't turned it over, but he whoop go ahead that jab dog. Ha ha go ahead, Shimizu. Get bit. Oh, 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 good good combination from Ramirez. Oh, 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 good hooks from Ramirez. Oh, yeah, yeah. I don't care about Shimizu. Kick. Kick. <laughs> That brother there was shooting that jab. I, was it landing? No, it wasn't landing. It was not landing. But who cares, bro? That, hey, let me see. On my way to work uh, for the Navy. Much love, brother. Thank you. But thank God for you. Also, have you seen a worse one-sided beatdown than Mayweather versus Gotti? Much love. No. <laughs> A good, no, no. No, no. That, it, it's, no, dog. 
Uh uh-uh. uh. I mean, Sonny Liston versus Floyd Patterson. You know, there's been some, but that for the duration. Let me see. Will Jamel drop Canelo? I he could, but that Canelo got a chin. How do you see that? See, I think Jamel wins. I think Jamel, unless is not, unless Canelo changes. If you that walking forward, Canelo one punch at a time. I'm leaning towards Jamel, but Canelo could definitely win. Um, I I think he outpoints him, but um, Canelo can knock him out. You know. Oh, good left to the body from Ramirez. He can he can mess around, and knock Jamel ass out. So, I, you know, is but I'm 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 leaning towards Jamel. Appreciate the fight call as I drive in. Much love, brother. Thank you so much. Two minutes thirty seconds in the third round. Look, look. I don't care about look, dog. Is he landing the jab? No. But Shimizu, can't can't. Left hand. He like look, look, look. Ramirez is a little bothered. I'm sorry, bro, because that jab is it landing? But oh, good hook. But he's keeping he keeping Ramirez at bay. Ramirez got to block that jab. Good combination from Shimizu. I don't when Shimizu found that. Oh, good combination from Ramirez. Damn. When Shimizu found that jab, bro. Go ahead. Stop. I like how he's shooting it. That el that elbow's down. Think. Look, oh, good laugh from Ramirez. Oh, shit. He, look, that brother got a chin. Look, let me tell you, he is that jab is educated because he's doing this and he gets a little closer. It's a weird time jab. It's not just a jab. It's educated. He, bah, look, look, he's bouncing around. you, bah, And then it comes out. Look, see? You don't know when the jab's going to come out, dog. <laughs> he, he gets that jab just an inch closer, a hair closer. Well, whoop your ass. Oh, good, good right hook for Ramirez. I think, I think, oh, good left hook. Ramirez is winning the fight. Good left hook again. I just like the jab <laughs> from Shimizu. Good jab from Ramirez. Oh, good uppercut from, from Ramirez. Because Shimizu got enough of a chin. Look, here come back to the jab. Ooh, oh, good, good right hook. Back to the jab. He's not countering the jabs. So, Combination missed from Ramirez. Here, pop, pop. <laughs> Look, Shamiju. Pop. Oh, good left from Shamiju. He got a chip. Pop. Work. Hey, Shamiju. Boom by A. <laughs> How you say his name, dog? <laughs> oh, good uppercut from Ramirez. That boy found that jab. He looked like a, you know, like a praying mantis. His arm so long. That boy. Let me see. Ramirez looking to slip the jab and throw the hook. Yeah, David. If he can, it's a weird time. Oh, good hook. From Ramirez. Oh, good jab, Ramirez. Look, look, look at that. Ha! Ha, ha, ha. Go ahead. Look, look, look. Ha, ha. Shimizu shooting the jab. Ha! Oh, damn it. Good hook from Ramirez. Shimizu right there. As long as you got the chin. Hey, I don't care, bro. <laughs> I don't care, bro. That boy got a Larry Holmes. <laughs> hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> it's, he shoots that jab once, one, one jab every 30 seconds, boy. Hey. <laughs> that jab got so much seasoning. <laughs> I, hey, look, I, Ramirez is winning the fight, but I'm loving the 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 edu, education. <laughs> you got a chin, yeah? You fight like Joe Joyce, bro. The Japanese got some of the best chins, no cap. I'm saying, I keep saying that when people say Mexican, I'm like Japanese. Showbiz, I believe Fulton will win. And EJ, love you, love you, boy. I, I'm with you. <laughs> Told y'all about Ramirez and relevant. Uh, he beat Shakur. Yeah, everybody know that, brother. Yeah, he, he beat him in uh, the Olympics. Got to go, man. Um, good jab from from Ramirez. Good, good, good. Oh, 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 good combination from Ramirez. I always thought Shakur got robbed, though. I thought Shakur won that fight in the Olympics. I swear I did, but I can see how Ramirez won. Oh, good jab, Ramirez. That was good fainting. Oh, now see, now he's fainting. That he he found something. He found something. Pop. There you go. 
Yeah, he found something on your ass, though. She means you. You were doing it, but now the faint uppercut and throwing shit from different angles, kind of throwing, shoot that jab. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh, good jab from Ramirez. That that jab from Shimizu is thirty seven years young. Oh, good uppercut from Ramirez. Oh, good jab, Ramirez. Yeah, you got to jab back, Ramirez, because that jab been been mar marinating. It's been exfoliating for for thirty seven, thirty eight years, bro. Oh, good uppercut from Ramirez, right through the right through the cleavage. Oh, good, good. Oh, good. Oh shit, yeah, Ramirez, Ramirez about to knock him out, dog. <laughs> shit. Oh, oh shit. Oh, Ramirez. Shoot that jab, Shimizu. Shoot it. Hey. Hey. Go ahead. Left, left hook from Shimizu. Work. Shoot the jab. Hey. Left hand. Hey. Left hand on you. Hup. Hup, hup. Uppercut. Oh, Ramirez. Don't fight on the inside, Shimizu. Step back, please. Good jab. There you go. Keep working. Ramirez got to do a lot. Oh, good jab for Ramirez. He got to do a lot. Shimizu working. He working. Hey. Oh, oh, good left. Yeah. Ramirez threw a left. Good jab, Ramirez. You got to jab back. That's the only way. One minute left in the fourth round. Good left foot. They slug it, dog. Oh, good uppercut, Shimizu. Uh oh, oh, Ramirez mad. Damn, you shouldn't have landed the punch. You shouldn't. Oh, land, oh shit. Got Shimizu against the ropes. He shouldn't have. Oh, damn. He shouldn't have. Oh, oh damn. You landed one punch, bro. You, you almost messed up, bro. Oh, look, Shimizu back at it. Jab. Oh. Hey, left hand. Hey, hey, hey. There you go. Hey, uppercut. She means you work. Don't hit him, though. If you hit him, you're going to be back on, on the ropes. Oh, counter left miss. You throwing that left from way back here, though. I mean, you telegraphing that left, though, Ramirez. You, you, come on now. You got to shorten that up now. Good combination. Oh, good uppercut from Ramirez. Uh-huh. Huh. He making Ramirez fight a lot. Because of that jab. He, see, he got to dip down like Sweet Pea Whitaker. 10 seconds left in the fourth. Good jab. Ooh. Oh, good jab back, Ramirez. Oh, shit. There you go, Ramirez. See, that jab almost knocked Shamiz you out. Ha! Oh, that jab. Yeah, it's a whip. <laughs> I was telling Ramirez to shoot the jab. Jab over his jab or something. Do something. Yeah, new A, new A versus Fulton is coming. Yeah, he's throwing that left from the Western hem Hemisphere. Um, I'm big in Japan. Are you? Shimizu needs to go to the body. Yeah, he needs to go to the body. Did new A fight start? No. -uh. Worst commentary. What they what they're saying? Uh, feels like uh, we're listening to news and radio. Uh, that Manta style ain't working. That Manta style is doing, that's all he got. That's all he has, bro. He doesn't, what he has is a jab. And so if use what you got. Five, round five, two minutes. For, oh, good. Right hook from Ramirez. Oh, left to the body. Man in the middle of the ring, work, work. Good head movement, Ramirez. Oh, good left hook. Oh, good right hand from Ramirez. All from Ramirez. Shoot the jab. Shoot the jab. Ha, Shizu. Fat. What's his name? Shimizu. Good jab from Shimizu. Just, it, I mean, Ramirez is blocking everything. Yeah. Let's let's not let's not get that messed up. But what I'm saying, oh, he hurt him. Oh, uppercut. Ramirez hurt. Oh, shit. Uppercut. Oh, he hurt. He hurt. Ramirez walking down. Ah, he finally cracked it. Oh, shit. Oh, he knocked him down. Oh, God. Blood's starting to trickle. Blood is on trickle. Shimizu is down. He cracked that jaw. Oh, blood's everywhere. Shit. Look, blood spinning out his mouth. He's ready. Go ahead, Shimizu. Shimizu ready. Coming back out. Blood leaking. Bop. Good uppercut. Oh, shit. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. You might as well call it. You might want to call it. Oh, oh. Hey, you might want to call it. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. <laughs> they stopped the fight. Ramirez ended it. Shimizu, they had TKO on the fifth. What, the fifth? That's it, dog. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The blood was leaking. His head was snapping back. It was over with, dog. <laughs> No, no, Shimizu's done, dog. <laughs> that, that's how you close it. All he had was a jab. All he had, and the jab couldn't even land. 
but he had that mug. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Bruh, Jack A is over. Yeah, it's over with. Fulton versus Inoue. <laughs> Poor guy. He wanted to fight, but ref called it right. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Bro. Yeah, the ref called it right, though. The ref, the ref called it right. You, you, had, you had to call that. You had to call that. This is just one of those fights. It's just a fight. Nope. Nobody will ever remember this fight, though. <laughs> will anyone ever remember Ramirez versus Shimizu? No, nobody will ever remember that. But you can say that he fought in Japan. Like, you know what I mean? So that's going to be there. He stopped him easy. Yeah, yeah, that was over. That was that was over with. It, you felt that Ramirez could have stopped him anytime. But like I said, a lot of times, look at Stitch Duran. A lot of times, um, y'all on a schedule. So if you can make the fight last a little bit longer, please do. Plus, on top of that, he went through a whole training camp. He traveled to Japan. He didn't do all that to knock him out in one round. He wanted to get some rounds in, work up a good sweat, you know, and then get him out of there. <laughs> hey, he tried. Yes, he did. He tried. It was a fight for sure. Well, it, it was one-sided. Damn, look at your usual eyes. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, a little swollen a little bit. Since uh the first, you knew. Yeah, 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 yeah. We knew what was up. <laughs> I enjoyed it. Uh-huh. Spoiler alerts in the comments, Biz. Uh, don't read because you're behind. Oh, no. I'm behind. Oh, I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. Why does Shimizu's punching uh, look so uncoordinated and weak? Uh, how was he an Olympian? Uh, well, I, I can see what, how he was effective. I can see how he was effective. It's just that, you know, Ramirez wasn't playing. The closer the fight get, the more I got TC whooping EJ ass. Uh-huh. I think Bud will stop Spence. I think Bud is just too advanced, high IQ KO uh, from an uppercut. Everybody keeps seeing that uppercut, man. Everybody sees that uppercut because of the lunging of uh, Errol Spence. That's why I said, you know, if Errol Spence, he lunges like that when he's, um rusty so that's why i thought with him being out the ring he's going to be rusty again and he's going to lunge like that again and you can't be like that against terrence crawford so when they announced the fight i had terrence crawford because of that i saw what you see um but then i started looking at errol spence and he looks very defensively responsible so now i'm like the fight is about errol spence if he's defensively responsible and he doesn't lean over his front foot and he has his feet under him Errol Spence should break him down and win. He should beat him. Honestly, he should. If you think about it, if Errol Spence is defensively responsible, he should win. It's all about Spence. That's why everybody sees Spence getting caught because they see a counter shot. That's the only thing people see. Nobody, people, people don't really see Terrence Crawford just out boxing him and swimming without getting wet. And like, it's really. He's going to be catching Arrow while Arrow is over committing to his punches. That's what people see. So if Arrow Spence is defensively responsible, Arrow Spence should win. I, dude, I, if he's if he's bam and getting that getting that and just and getting it back, he should win. I mean, it's not like Terrence Crawford isn't going to hit him ever, but Crawford don't punch like Wilder. Though he's knocked out every welterweight, look at who he knocked out. So he doesn't punch like Wilder. You know what I mean? So let's get that out the way. It's not like as soon as he touched him, <laughs> let's get that out the way. So he is going to hit him. They're going to hit each other. But I'm saying if Errol Spence is defensively responsible, he should win. You're right. I agree. Yeah, he should win. But if he's over committing, Terrence Crawford can knock him out. For sure. Uh, Spence going to win 100 my man said, I don't know. Yeah, I, I hear you. Bud read minds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Superhuman. Is um, is he new way versus full to next? Yes. Yes. I don't know how those two hours flew by, but they definitely did. They flew right by, bro. Because it's like 7 a.m. Like, it, it flew. 
I'm expecting him to be on point. Spence will break him down when finishing him later rounds. I can see Spence catching him and knocking him out. Dude, I, I saw something else. Yo, bro, I saw something else. In that media workout, I, I saw Errol Spence hitting him right on the jaw, knocking him out. I saw it. I saw it. I saw it, bro. I saw it. He's going to be punching him the way he punched on middleweights and shit. And Terrence Crawford is not that durable. I'm looking at Terrence Crawford's fights. He's a little guy. He's not that durable. It's the same reason I can see Fulton knocking out Inoue. I can see Fulton knocking him out. But, you know, I'm not going to predict a knockout. But what I'm saying is, Errol Spence, see him knocking him out. I, he can hit around the jaw. I saw it. Yeah, he, bam, he's going to need for a boom. And it's going to be like, bro, he, he's going to be hurt. Terrence Crawford going to be hurt. He's going to do that wobble shit, and Errol Spence going to finish. And I'm going to be right there at the floor at, at the fight. <laughs> Yeah, Spence got that power. It's different. Um, let me see. Fulton by knockout in the eighth. I can see that. Uh huh. We going straight to Taco Tuesday biz. <laughs> no, you, you boy, that's you're hilarious. You are hardly. I've been on for two, four. How long I've been on? Two hours. <laughs> I'm I'm done for the day. You ain't gonna see a video or anything. I'm done for the day, bro. The only way I only way you get a video from May bars is if something spectacular kind of happens. Um, and I, I may go to sleep and wake up and then do like a video or something. Uh, if this fight goes past six rounds, it's over for Bud. If the oh, if the fight. <sighs> My brain goes goes past six rounds. It's over for butt. Uh, that's that's how I see it. Uh, thanks for commentating this fight so early, Biz. Uh, I'm here at work pretending to type. Yep, but watching the fight. <laughs> What's up, community? I used to I used to pretend to work and do nothing. That's how dumb I was. I, why not just work? I used to pretend to. Work. Why not just work? It 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 was. You make sense because you're getting entertained. But I used it was more work to pretend to work. It was far more work to pretend to work. And I used to sit there and pretend to work when I had work to do. Now that's you can't get dumber than that. I used to just I'm at the computer. The work is right there. I was just like, like, bro, I <laughs> I don't know what it was. I just didn't want to do it. I just didn't want to do it. <laughs> Facts. Bro, I never wanted to do I just did. This is the perfect job for me. I never, I never wanted to do anything that I was told to do. I think I have an issue. Bars. I, bro, I never wanted to do anything. If I, if so, I'm going to do it my way. <laughs> or I'm going to do something else. <laughs> so that's why I must be an entrepreneur. 40 minutes left, y'all. What do you want to talk about? 40 minutes left. <laughs> that's there. <laughs> oh, let me see. Better bring them belts back home. Man, I feel him for just going out there fighting, dog. I'm, I'm. He had me at hello, dog. <laughs> he had, he had me when he took the fight. I'm like, go ahead, Fulton. You my guy, bro. Oh, let me see. Uh, no, I'm the same way, brother. I just, I couldn't do. And the funny thing is, I always did well, though. Got promoted because I was creative. So I would create a job or do something. Hey, yo, let me tell you something, dog. <laughs> let me tell you something, dog. If the monster was a comedian, he would be Kevin Hart because they going to learn today. <laughs> hey, let me tell you something, dog. How's the movie coming along? It's not because of the strike. <laughs> let, me, let me tell you. Let me tell you. 
I had a job and I convinced my manager that I would be better at telling other people how to do it, right? But before I convinced them of that, let me tell you what I did. No cap. I was a contractor. I was a temp. I already had my master's and everything. But there was a massive layoff, right? And then they hired us back as temps. That's, you know, that's how they get you. But I was a temp. So a group of five, no, four temp employees, new people came in to learn about the job. When they came in that day, I called a meeting with only them. No cap. I called a meeting with them. And they didn't know who I was. And I trained them on the job. By the end of that day, they were already doing the job. Now, my manager, what he wanted was for them to get, you know, they weren't going to start doing the job until later that week. You know what I'm saying? Get your shit in order. Do this. This is your death. I trained them. They were doing the job by the end of the day. So he said, oh, you can project manage this. I didn't do shit. <laughs> they used to come to, I barely knew how to do the job. They used to come to me and say, is this right? And I'd be like, you know what? You can do this a little bit better. <laughs> I barely knew how to do the damn job. <laughs> That's the type of shit I used to do. I could not do the work, bro. I couldn't do the work. I had to create my own thing. <laughs> oh, let me see. Fulton decision. You know. Hey, 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 let me tell you. <laughs> I love that story, bro. It was so true. Hey, hey, listen, listen. Inoue had me when he didn't double, he didn't double stack the hand wraps. When Inoue was getting his hand wrapped and was asking the guy, is this how you want it? You want my hands like this? What else do you need? Bro, he had me there. The guy sitting there. Team Fulton is sitting there like, uh-huh, no, that's it. That's, that's it. They ain't even doing nothing. They, and they like, this, this, this is what you want. Funniest shit in the world. So now I feel if he knew a knocks him out, I would, bro, my giggle. <laughs> my giggle. That has to be the cockiest thing I've ever seen. How I wrap my hands is legal in Japan. It's my home. It's legal here, but whatever you want, anything else you need, because <laughs> I don't want to hear no shit. Dude, that right there is amazing. Uh, what do you think of Broner apologizing to the greats? I didn't see it. <laughs> the double stack fool. <laughs> oh, let me see. What, they show that? Yes, bro. They show him getting his hands wrapped. And Timothy Bradley was like, that. now that's not stacking. That's how you're supposed to do it. Funny as shit. Funny. They sold this whole idea for the bag. And everybody fell for it. It is beautiful marketing. Beautiful business move and marketing. And Timothy, this is why Timothy Bradley is still, he had, he kept, he stayed, he's, he has the job. <laughs> This is why Bradley had the job. Oh, <laughs> uh, let me see. Uh, Spence is uh, sadistic and loves pain and dishing pain. Terrence is more of an athlete. Many boxers doesn't like to get hit and uh, get into a war. Spence loves it. That's true. But on top of that, though, Terrence Crawford, uh, he must be in a war. He always slugs. That's the thing about Terrence. People think he's Floyd. He's not. Uh, Showbiz got 3,000 in the chat at 7 a.m. Brother, yeah, we're crazy. We're crazy. What's up, though? We're, we're wild. Shout out to everybody. <laughs> yeah, any excuses tonight, Steve? Yeah. Oh, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm happy you said that. I'm going to make a video. I got to make a video now and do that. Yeah. <laughs>
Let me see. Uh, he apologized to Floyd, Meek, Tank, Tim Charlo, Twin, Bud, Arrow. For what? What did he say? What did he do wrong? What did he do, dog? What did he do, dog? My guy, the mod is hilarious, dog. <laughs> dog. I told that story, though. I, hold on, hold on, let me see. Put punch that like button, uh, uh, one more again. Yeah, everybody hit the like. Well, don't do it one more. If you already hit the like, you'll be taking the like away. Don't do that. Don't take the like away. <laughs> and that's the black two sugars. No, the 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 point the point is the point is. I could, I can never do, I can never do what I'm told. Here's, here's another thing. Here's another thing. Here's another thing. Do you guys look, see my thumbnails? Have you guys really looked at my thumbnails? Do you guys just, have you guys really looked at my thumbnails? <laughs> have you got, just give it, just Given a good look at my thumbnails. Have you noticed how bad I look in all my thumbnails? <laughs> yo, yo, let me see. Now, Zier, uh, send me $10. Open uh, the app for more detail. Thank you so much, my brother. <laughs> bro, bro, no, no. I'm talking about when I do, not to show enough one, not to show enough, but when I'm just doing regular videos. Do I perf random fa facial expressions. Yeah, Baker, I purposely find the funniest face I've, I made. The worst face, like the worse I look, the better. I can never go with the grain. Instead of me looking cool in my thumbnails, I want to look bad. <laughs> I want to look bad. <laughs> I never want to. I want to look bad. I'll put that face. I want. I don't want to look. <laughs> I want to look bad because it's not about me looking good. It's not about me being cute. It's about the content. So I purposely. In my brain, I ain't trying to look good for nobody. I'm not trying to make this about me. I'm, and I just make that the thumbnail, bro. <laughs> I, I, mean, I, can, I just make that the thumbnail. <laughs> I love it because I can give a shit. Let me see. The smart fight is uh, for TC to outbox EJ early, make him desperate. Yep, then catch him later. Fantastic. Meanwhile, Fulton and uh, counter his jab. Meanwhile, Fulton got his hands for tonight. I don't know who wins this one. Me either. Me either. <laughs> Dog, thumbnail looking bad. That was a great breakdown, though. <laughs> I got it loaded up. Bro, I do that shit on purpose. <laughs> and that's how I live my life. Nobody's going to tell me how things should be. Ever. <laughs> Ever, bro. <laughs> Ever. Ever. The fact that I can... The fact that we can play Michael Jackson and have comic books in the back, and this is a boxing channel. <laughs> That's we we ain't doing anything like we should. <laughs> We're not doing anything like we should. <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> Hit the thumbs up for your boy. Show me as much love. Much love, brother. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Guys, why are they showing replays? Because it's almost time. That's how it is every fight. <laughs> uh, you do you, Biz. I swear. I swear, bro. <laughs> so welcoming. <laughs> Biz living in a Simpsons-like world. I swear. I swear. ESPN Plus. <laughs> yeah. 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 I have a taco hat on my head and a puppet and... Bro, we're just having a ball. 
We're having a ball. Biz got me crying. We're having a ball. But support boxing like nobody's business, though. But support boxing like nobody's business. And know the sport, too. Let me see. Um, is it natural for a corner to wipe gloves down between rounds? Um, yeah. Yeah, that, that makes sense. Yeah. I've seen it on a few occasions. Yeah, it is. Very much. Um, do you want, do you want to know why or it's, it's, I mean, that's a great question because that's something that any fight fan would know, but that lets me know that y'all still y'all learning and that's good. Spencer's jab would neutralize Bud's speed. Not if Bud can counter the jab. He has to, he has to counter the jab. He has to counter the jab. So, um. It's natural for, yeah, keep it dry. There you go, to cut them. There you go. Because you don't want, you know, they put Vaseline on the face. So you're punching Vaseline all the time. You don't want to keep it on the glove. You want it dry, right? So you wipe you wipe that shit down. Bam, right? People, I mean, it's, it's very, very, it's, it's proper. It's what you should do. EJ's fundamentals are so solid, I don't think, TC has the ability to break, I mean, to be, to wait, years of, oh, break years of good habits in a 12 round. Terrence Crawford has bad habits. See, okay, let, let me tell you, let me tell you. And, and well, like you said, Errol Smith has good habits. But Errol Smith has bad habits too. He, like I said, he he punches, he leans over his front foot a lot. Inoue does that. Inoue, watch, Inoue reaches too much. Fulton could catch, he could catch Inoue with an uppercut. Inoue reach way too much. He does it all the time. But so did Pacquiao. Um, but the thing that I fear with Terrence Crawford, okay, I fear Errol Spence rushing his shots and and lunging with his punches, and I fear that Terrence Crawford, what makes him so good, kind of went down a little bit because father time is a real thing, so that his legs aren't quite what they were, and he rely a lot on his athleticism. Athleticism, I mean, that's what I'm worried about with Terrence Crawford, to be honest, right? Like, let me see. Um, Rise and shine, Biz Black, Two Sugars, and the live, brother. Whew. Whew. Brother, this, this is exhausting. Uh, let me see. <laughs> ESPN, oh, the app is bugging? I don't see it. Best commentator on YouTube. Thank you so much. Much love, my brother. T TC has a lot of bad habits. Yeah, okay, his his bad, that's the thing. His bad habits are good for him. So Muhammad Ali was full of bad habits. He let his hands down. He leaned straight back, barely go to the body. <gasps> Horrible bad habits. But if he fought any other way, he wouldn't have been as good. Um, He knew his body. It's, all, it's just all about doing what's best for what, how God gifted you or whatever you believe. So... Um, um, Roy Jones had a ton of bad habits, right? But you didn't want him to be textbook. He wouldn't have been punching from the angles he could and and throwing hooks instead of jabs. So, uh, but it falls apart once those bad habits go. And a lot of times you don't know when they're gone until they go. So I'm a little worried about that, actually. Uh, love what you're doing, bro. Uh, I'm going for Fulton. I I totally get it, bro. I, I have if you're going for Inoue or Fulton, I'm fine. Dog. I I don't. Um, make sure you guys bet on Bet US though. Bigger, easier to use, and safe. The QR code right here. The link is in the description box below. Add Showbiz to the promo code. You guys going for whoever? Put a bag on it. All right, get to the bag. Crawford gets caught in Southpaw. Yeah, but Crawford is more dangerous in Southpaw. It becomes a fight. He boxes in Orthodox. He fights in Southpaw. When he goes to Southpaw, it's a scrap. It's a full scrap. And that's when he's at his best. But he boxes in Orthodox. And not and not all the time um, is boxing better than fighting. Not all the time. Mm -mm. And like I said, Sugar Ray Leonard versus Hearns. When Sugar Ray Leonard was boxing, you're blowing it, kid. You're blowing it. When he started fighting, he knocked him out. 
So it's not boxing isn't always better than fighting. You know, that's why Terrence Crawford been so successful at welterweight. Let me see. Get the likes up. Yeah, everybody, please hit the like. Uh, Biz owns Bet US. I wouldn't trust it. Here's here's the thing, Magic. Please don't lie on my brand. All right, that's no good. I feed my family this way. So seriously, you know, it's not cool because I'm just I'm they sponsor me. So um, I'm advertising for. It. I don't own it. If I owned it, bro, I wouldn't be doing this. Owning Bet US, you wouldn't see me. I'll be somewhere on the islands, rich as shit. But don't lie on my brand, bro. This is how I feed my family. If you're if you're successful in convincing people of this, you just ruin my dreams, and you you ruin how I make a living. Why would you want to do that? So stop. You know, y'all be hating really really bad. Like stop. Let me see. Uh, EJ's body work will slow down TC movement, or vice versa. You know, you're you're hearing. You're hearing people talk about how Terrence Crawford should go to Errol Spence's body, which I like that idea. Like when Tyson Fury stepped forward against Wilder, let me be the puncher. And it's like, what? That's a good idea. No, a good idea. So, um, yeah, I would like to see that. Terrence Crawford going to Errol Spence's body. Uh, Let me see. Bro, showbiz, uh, I went and got some Chick-fil-A breakfast. Oh, go ahead, dog. I'm starving. Eat that. I ain't got shit. Eat that. From, dog. Mm. Kill. Kill it. Biz, uh, you best hit 200000 by this. I would have. I would have, but I'm not doing the fight commentary for Errol Spence and Terrence Crawford. If I was doing a commentary, how much I hyped up this fight, this, I would have had a million views. I promise you I would have had a million views. I promise you. How much I hype this fight up. And man, if you type Errol Spence, Terrence Crawford, I'm showing up, right? My videos and everything show. So I would have, but that's, I'm going to the fight. I sacrifice, I'm going to the fight. But I definitely would have reached 200,000. I would have had giveaways, but I'm still going to have giveaways because the PBC said that they're giving away merch strictly from the PBC for me to give to you guys. Hit the Tyson Bell. Let me see. For real, Biz. Uh-huh. Have uh, the likes for this video gone up? Yeah, everybody hit the like. Hit the like right now. We got an opportunity for everybody to hit the like. There's going to be 5,000 people in here, though. If everybody hit the like, there's gonna be... I literally just woke up. Brother, I woke up screaming. I had the worst dream ever. Uh, Biz, do you think the loser will be so embarrassed they're quitting boxing? No, what? No, uh, -uh. winner. Look, dude, fighters don't respond like everybody else. Fighters, fighters lose all the time in sparring and shit. No, we we have that. Fighters don't have that. Let me see. Biz, uh, taking over. Hit the like. Thank you so much, my brother. The we have that. That's why the people in the black suits be ruining boxers' careers. A fighter will fight anybody. A fighter would fight anybody. It's the business that's afraid of the fighters of losing. Uh, TC shouldn't uh, go to EJ body. I think he should. That would be him stepping out of character. I think he should. Um, the F, wait, was he one off? TC has flash knockdown, uh, not body breakdown power. I think he should. I think, I think what you just said, J. Will, Errol Spence, no. Right? So don't be what they trained for. Show a wrinkle that they haven't trained for. Like, I think Errol Spence should go orthodox at some point. Give them a different look. When a fight is this, when you're fighting somebody as great as they're fighting, like when fighting each other, what you said right there, you don't think Errol Spence knows that? You don't think Terrence Crawford knows that? They know way more than you do. So don't do what's expected. Rip to the body. Don't not go to the body. And when we say go to the body, it doesn't mean just look at the body and go to it. Go to the body. And then you can drop that guard. That's just boxing. Then you can catch upstairs. No, no, no.
you tripping, bro. You tripping big. Uh, hit the like. I'm trying to. Uh, I'm trying to get 10k people in the war room. Yeah, safe bet over under on the rounds, Biz. Over. Uh, what are your thoughts? Over, dog. This fight. This fight can go to distance, bro. What? Thank you so much. Roll out. Thank you so much, brother. <laughs> I don't know what roll out said right there, but thank. You. Good morning, War Room and Showbiz. Showbiz, I made a vid on Twitter. It's a message for you in the War Room. It's important. I got you, Curious Old Ace. I got you, dog. Here's the Tyson Bale. I'll check it out. I'll check it out, brother. Did you at me? Let me see. Uh, what else we got? A dollar. Thank you so much, Alan Sims. Everybody giving the cash apps. Thank you so much. And make sure you hit the like. How many likes we got right now? Let me see before I, I finish exfoliating. One point K, two thousand of you mugs ain't hit two thousand, ain't hit the like two. I can understand if five hundred, two thousand ain't hit the like shit. I can understand, brother. That's not giving a damn about me being up since three a.m. That's just not giving a damn. Thanks for all you do, showbiz, and can't do that. Damn, bro. Let me see. Uh. War room, uh, y'all up early, up early and not hitting the light, just pop. That's jeez, 2000. Whoa, that's come on, y'all. Sully, why? Yeah, I gotta play the damn song. I gotta play the song. Hold on, real quick. Hold on, hit the hit the lights, get those, get the thumbs up, hit the hit the lights, get those, get the thumbs up, hit the. Hit the like, get those, get the thumbs up, hit the, hit the like, get those, get the thumbs up, hit the, hit the like, get those. Biz, Brandon Roth, Superman versus Ben Affleck, Batman. Who's Brandon Roth? <laughs> Sorry, dog. Who is Brandon Roth? Uh, yeah, I tagged you on Twitter. It's lit. Let me exfoliate, dog. Let me exfoliate. See, I don't see it, bro. All right. Oh. Dog. Drew is Jorge here. I got a message for you, showbiz the adults. I'm very disappointed in you, first of all. Uh, actually, first of all, I'm wearing my Kayla Plant Kayla Plant shirt because my Spence shirt hasn't come in yet. I'm very disappointed. I, I give up at this point. 80 bucks down the drain. But I got a message for you, showbiz adult. I'm very disappointed at you because you have covered mostly everything about Earl the True Spence. Or Earl, I'm, I'm sorry, Earl the Broker Spence. Thank versus you. Terrence Bud Crawford. You missed something. What? You have covered their first announcement on a post on Instagram. Mm -hmm. Earl Spence won that. You have covered the both press conferences. Earl Spence has won that. And the second one. You have covered the media workout. Earl Spence has won that. And possibly, I'll give it a tie between the merch. Well, no, actually, Bud won the merch because shirt Spence didn't give him my shirt. And I live down the street. But you forgot something. Who won? <laughs> Who won the poster? <laughs> well, I got a job today. I got to do this for the community as well. So who won the poster of Earl the Broker Spence versus Terrence Bud Crawford? I got the answer for you, ladies and gentlemen. You ready? Yeah. Tell you why. Why? Why? Who done my man's hairline, brother? <laughs> oh my goodness. Looking like the stock market went up and down on Earl Spence's forehead. <laughs> they done they done did my man's dirty. 
<laughs> oh my goodness. So, there's Bud Crawford won the on the poster. Oh my Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. That was good. That was good, dog. <laughs> that was that was really good. That was really good. Hold on. Hold on, brother. That was really good. Where we at? Where we at? <laughs> at the end dog or maybe i did because i think i kicked out my <laughs> i laughed so hard i think i kicked out my internet <laughs> good morning biz i got full to my decision uh, that makes sense oh uh, let me see biz uh angel garcia trains fulton i have to go with inoue now uh garcia be tripping on that fentanyl stop 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 <laughs> That brother said his hairline, dog. His hair. <laughs> he said his hairline lost him the poster. You're right. You're right. Everybody, give Curious Jorge. <laughs> Who won the poster? Terrence Bud Crawford won the poster by hairline. <laughs> that was pretty lit. That was pretty lit. That was pretty lit. That was pretty lit. Uh, let me see. Uh, has the ring walk happened? No, I will tell you, bro. I will tell you. We're sitting here chilling. Everything that will happen will be told. Uh, <laughs> let me see. Uh, the Esau Cruz fight. He's fighting on the undercard of uh, Spence versus Crawford. Uh, they said men's away like men's ago. Yeah, well, I remember. Yeah, it's 10 minutes away right here. They got the time right here, bro. 10 minutes away. Good morning, BS. Needed that laugh. Hair like, yeah, that was pretty funny. That was pretty funny, bro. That was pretty funny. He said, like, like showbiz hairline. He said Terrence Crawford had that showbiz that straight. My my there was a minute where I, when I thought I was losing my hair. I'm gonna tell you. There was a minute when I thought I was losing my hair. But what it was was stress. It was stress. Y'all don't realize I was stressed as shit at a certain point with me and my brother and what we were going. My hairline was starting to 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 to, to, to recede. Hey, hey, where does uh, Inoue rank in pound for pound if he makes the fight looks like pop shit? If he beats the hell out of Fulton, sorry. Uh, if he beats the hell hell out of Fulton, and, and he probably he's number one until Spence versus Crawford, bro. Whoever wins this fight, look. If Inoue wins this fight, he's number one for three days. <laughs> You might as well don't even make a pound for pound list because whoever wins Terrence, Craw Terrence Crawford and Errol Spence is the best fighter in the world. <laughs> and that's the Black Two Sugar. So he'll be the best for about two days, dog. <laughs> he'll be. Uh, yeah, Jorge is hilarious. Here is Jorge is hilarious, dog. Inoue, uh, top three pound for pound. He top three pound for pound now, right? Look, I'm going to tell you who's a pound for pound fighter. And I don't think he's getting enough credit at all. And that's Jamel Charlo. Jamel Charlo was sitting there undisputed, got every, he took the title from every one of them and about to fight Canelo. I don't know what that man needs to do. To get, he was about to fight Tim Zoo and said, never mind, I'll fight Canelo Alvarez at 168. That guy is showing a level of integrity that is incredible. And no one gives a shit. This guy is one of the best fighters in the world. And I'm like the only one holding him down. I'm like, yo, Jamel, bruh. <laughs> and nobody cares. It's like, it's wild. Let me see. Showbiz and Wave are both doing great things for the sport of boxing. Oh, boxing. Oh, that's my guy. And yes, Crawford has won, won, won <laughs> uh, the poster up off it for the hairline. That was funny. Uh, great stuff from Curious. That, that was incredible. And it's on my Twitter feed. So please, please uh, retweet it. Uh, let me see. Uh, they be hating. Brother, they be hating big. I, 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 <laughs> I don't know. This guy, Jamel, is arguably top five fighters in the world. I got him over Errol Spence now for sure. I got him over Errol Spence and Terrence Crawford right now. I do. Until, you know, come Saturday. But I'm just saying. I'm looking at this guy do shit, you know. 
They've been chilling. Errol Spence fighting once every three years. Terrence Crawford fighting David Ebenezer and shit. Like, I'm, yo. <laughs> I've been like, Jamel, forget what y'all talking about, bro. There, there's, and I've been naming guys before everybody hit the light. Before, um, before Teofimo Lopez beat Josh Taylor. I was saying Teofimo, now that he beat Josh Taylor, all of a sudden, there's Teofimo Lopez fans saying how he'll beat Devin Haney. And how he'll be, he'll be a problem for Tank. And now people are talking shit. He'll beat Ryan Garcia. He, that, that, he, people are very microwave. But before then, I was like, remember I did that video? The best are, I was like, Lomachenko, Teofimo, Jamel Charles. I was talking about people, Sean Porter. I was talking about people who really fight in the fights, bro. I was like, those guys, bro really fighting the fights those are the guys i'm feeling <laughs> remember that and to was one of them he was one of them and now he's getting his love he should have been got got the love let me see um espn plus uh we blessed with super fights this year blessed blessed everybody make sure you hit the like here we go is starting now. How behind am I? Oh, five minutes until the fight. I was about to say. My goodness. Everybody, make sure you hit the like. Oh, let me see. I want to see if this is it still playing. Oh, it is still playing. We still got a thousand of you who haven't hit the like yet. So make sure you hit the like. Uh, is Canelo overrated? Is Canelo overrated? I, no. Mm -mm. Canelo's not overrated. Fulton is overhyped. No, because he's not even hyped. <laughs> Fulton ain't even hyped. What are y'all talking about, though? A new member, baby. baby, baby. <laughs> Fulton ain't even hyped. People got he knew a winning. Oh, uh, let me see. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Charles Baker, he he think he definitely thinks. Uh, he definitely thinks. Uh, uh, Canelo is overrated. Uh, twenty more minutes. No, 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 no. Ain't twenty more minutes. Fulton will be running. Uh, no, Fulton be in a pocket. Uh, do y'all watch? Do y'all watch boxing or? <laughs> Do y'all watch boxing or yeah, it's a commercial right now. Or do y'all <laughs> what do y'all be on though? <laughs> Canelo is overrated. Well, well, I'll tell you this. If Canelo is overrated, then everybody is. And that's the black two sugars. He has the best resume in the game. He has the best resume in the game. Uh, sent you five dollars open. Thank you so much, Michael Fisher. He got one of the best resumes in the world. If he's overrated, everybody is. Everybody in the fight game. That means everybody from Tyson Fury to Terrence Crawford, Inoue, they all overrated. Exactly. Yeah. Errol Spence. If Canelo's overrated, they all are. I uh Boo Boo Andre, Charlo, David Benavidez, they all are. <laughs> if he's overrated, they all are. The funny thing is, the only people who call him overrated are people who don't box, or us. All the fighters, Sugar Shakur, Steve, everybody know that Canelo's the truth. Everybody respects Canelo. Everybody. The only ones who don't are people who don't fight, have no idea. <laughs> us, us, we're the only ones that disrespect Canelo. No fighter. That's why I said you got to listen to the fighters. The fighters know who the truth is. Let me see. Flex on them. Seep, 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 pow. King Kong ain't got on me. Let me see. What's up, showbiz? What's going on, my brother? Thank you so much for the super chat. <laughs> That's not what overrated means. Oh, well, what does overrated means? He shouldn't get a lot of support. Like, I don't, what, what does overrated, what do you mean by overrated? What? Give me your definition.
so I can just know what y'all talking about. <laughs> Cap, I box and his ass overrated to me. Well, not, I'm talking about like in the game, like Charles Baker, you're not respected by fighters, right? So I'm talking about like in the game. Nobody, nobody's check, you know, Sugar Shakur Stevenson ain't saying that Charles Baker can scrap. You know what I mean? I, you know, we, we throw hands, but I'm talking about fight like pro fighters. Pro fighters who know the sacrifice and the business and all that, they respect Canelo. Uh, Biz, how come we are the only country that roots for the other guy every fight, no matter how good they are? Uh, the hype train is literally the other guy. One, you just lied to yourself and you don't have to. So Americans don't root for the other guy every time, no matter what. That's a lie. All right. You know, that's a lie because you're American and you're not. So not every American is rooting for the other guy every time. So you just lied. Two, that's a beautiful thing that you or I or whomever can root for who the hell we want. And I prefer that. I don't want to have to do anything. I told I was I brought that up earlier. I remember rooting for Usain Bolt in the Olympics and I'm American. So for me, I root for whoever the hell I want. I've rooted for AJ many times. I rooted for AJ against Andy Ruiz, right? So I root for whoever I want. And that's the beauty. Thank goodness I can do what I want with my own brain. And I expect I would prefer everybody to do what they want with their own brains. That, But that's my explanation. <laughs> now, if you don't like that and want everybody to have to be a certain way their whole lives, but it, like I said earlier, you look at me, there's nothing conventional about me. So I don't do conventional shit, right? I'm eccentric. I'm like, I, I didn't do boxing the way people thought it should be done. I don't feel I have to do anything. I don't have to fit a mold of anybody. I'm me, unique, independent. Let me see. Uh, De La Cruz, $3. Thank you so much. Hit the Tyson Bay. So I'm always pro doing what you want, right? Oh, uh, let me see. The countdown is done. Correct. Uh-huh. All right, let's go. About time. <laughs> About time, bro. Big facts. Yeah. We need that taco hat, Biz. You know what? I got you. Man. It is Taco Tuesday. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? <laughs> Let me see. Uh, uh, we do what we want because we freemen, and that's uh, the black tojo. You ain't lying, brother. <laughs> you ain't lying. I got a taco hat on and a strap season shirt. I don't give a shit. Never have, never will. <laughs> Let me see. True. Uh, come on, man. Let's go. Let's get on with the fight, y'all. Come on now. Wait. Got to use the bathroom now. So hold on. Hold on. Don't start the fight yet. Now I got to use the bathroom. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let me tell you something, man. I'm going to tell y'all this. I'm going to tell y'all this. Yeah, get your popcorn ready. I'm going to tell y'all this. What that comment was about was about you caring about how everybody feel about you. And I'm going to say this, that I learned in over my 42 years of being alive. Don't worry about what people think about you because you can't make everybody happy. And I mean that from the bottom of my heart. What do I think about what people do? I don't. 
And that's why I don't care about what y'all think about me. <laughs> All right. Oh, uh, let me see. Let me see. Um, Mexican food uh, makes everybody use the bathroom, even if they wear it. <laughs> That do hilarious. That do hilarious. Well said. Yes, Lord. Preach your biz. I'm telling you. Yeah. Yeah. I'm yo. Great content, bro. Brother. One of the first the the reason why I got hip to boxing. The reason why I got hip to boxing is because of marvelous Marvin Hagler. And at four years old, he blew my mind. Because everybody I saw, how about this? Every brother I saw, they showing Inu in the back right now, hopping up and down. Every brother I saw had an Afro or a Jerry curl. The first boxing match I ever I can re, I can recognize that I was online and watched. Online, I mean this online and watch. I saw a bald head man. <laughs> and that wasn't cool. To have a bald head was funny. You roasted people with bald heads back then. Your hair was either an afro or a jerry curl. That dude had a bald head. And I was like, like, he looked scary, bro. <laughs> and from, so you got some, and his name was Marvelous. He didn't look marvelous. He looked rugged. But his name was Marvelous. And I got hip on that guy. That was one of the first BU moments I've ever had. <laughs> I saw Hagler and was like, what the hell? Talking about having your own identity. <laughs> I'm telling you, I've been hip on being yourself. You can, you can only be great if you be you. Because there's only one you. Let me see. Ahead of his time. I swear. I swear. Bro, I, I, I was born during a time where I literally saw. <laughs> that's the black two sugars. Yeah, Francisco. Thing. Bro, I was born during the facts biz. Bro, I was born during a time. Where they're about to sing national it, it, it fight by start. I was born during a time where I literally saw Michael Jackson going down the street like it's close to midnight and something evil. <laughs> and then he turns into a zombie. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, <laughs> okay, first of all, that if you can do that, bro, you can do anything. Nobody was doing that. This dude made a horror movie, music, fun, you know, zombies popping. He, he just, <laughs> that's what I was born in. So if you see me with a strap season shirt, a taco hat going, ah! <laughs> I have all the confidence in the world in being me and doing what I feel, bro. <laughs> you mad funny brother. <laughs> brother. Think about that. Here we go. Ah, here we go. At least a, a title sequence or they showing the this is too this is taking too long. Never stop being you biz. I will not, bro. And and the same back at you, brother. Breaking bud now on, on pay-per-view. Mm -mm -mm. Uh but you didn't want a bald head biz. I ended up I, I cut my hair bald in high school. Yep. It wasn't cool in high school. I went against the grain. I was bald for three years. I had a bald head from junior year to uh, freshman year in college. But that's when I was uh, right, racist. <laughs> I, I, was, I was the black weapon, dog. I had a black power fist around my chest. I used to wear fatigues and a bald head. And I was just like, the black man needs to rise. And power through, like I was, bro, bro. And then I learned so much that I was like, ah, I get it. <laughs> I learned so much that I was like, oh, I get it. All right, let me let me get let me get my degree 
get a family, raise my kids. Let me see, thirty dollars for the KO plus a thousand uh, equals three hundred dollars. Spence KO plus six hundred equal eighteen hundred. Okay, plus three hundred original bet. Whoa, on bet you doing that on bet US? Get brother, get to the bag. Get to the bag. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Where's my get to the Eddie? <laughs> uh, bet us on Bet US. Bigger, easier to use, and safe. The link is in the description box below. Make sure you add Showbiz to the promo code. Let me see. Everyone else is taken already. Uh, why not you? Why not be you? Yeah, there you go. Everyone else is taken already. Why not be you? That was that. Let me see. Uh, two dollars from West. Thank you so much. Ain't nothing but a gangster party. West Side. Uh, let me see. Imagine the fight is canceled for some emergency. Stop. Don't stop. Stop. Spin the sound. Biz, who you got? I. Yo, I, I, I don't know. I'm I'm not gonna fall for this, bro. I literally don't know. If I pick one, I I I don't know. Uh, ESPN has a slot as a time slot, and damn it, they're gonna stick to it. I'm telling you, Malik. I'm telling you, they wanted Ramirez to carry Shimizu uh longer. I'm brother. I'm telling you, uh, you went against the grain, huh? So that uh, must mean you were talking, you were walking around with that uh, Nestle Crunch noggin. Yeah, yeah, bro. Yeah, no, no, no. My skin was smooth. My skin was smooth, but I, 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 I went back. I went back with with the liners. Zzz, zzz. I was smack ball, smack ball. Let me see. Would Terrence Crawford be able to dig deep? He's never had to do that before, so we we'll, we'll see. He may think he is digging deep when he don't know what digging deep is. You know, there's people that's like, yo, I really tried. No, you didn't. So you know, we'll find out. Uh, let me see. Here we go now. Jeez. Whew. My goodness. What's good, Biz, from Bronx, New York? Man, much love, bro. Spence had, Showbiz, has Spence ever been hurt? Uh, probably multiple times. Um, like, every fighter gets hurt, even when you don't notice it. Um, I think he has. I, I think Danny Swift Garcia him a, a real good shot. But I, I showed all the punches that hurt Spence. Um, speaking of Michael Jack, these lights, boy. <laughs> yeah, uh huh. Finally, Inoue wins and Bud wins. Trust me, <laughs> no, trust me, it's not enough, bro. Let me see. Uh, Biz being bald at 15 is crazy. Yeah, I was bald. A lot had to do with Tupac, too. You know, what I mean, I, I was, I was, no, I was ridiculous. Though. <laughs> I was, I was, I was ridiculous. Though. I was like a, I was like a nerdy, a, I was like a nerdy fighting. I, I don't know what I, I, I what I am. You know, I'll read comic books and say some nerdy shit and then get into a fight. And like I was. I wasn't a thug, so I was just I had a well, I still got a temper. So I, was, I don't know, though. <laughs> I can't call what what I was mean. Dog. Let me see. I can't wait to hear Angel Garcia in the corner instruction be like. Hit him in the face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Punch him in the mask. Let me see. Mayweather Chico uh, was more lopsided than Gotti. Dog, Chico, at least Chico had, he had something about him. Gotti was just sitting there at the receiving end. Here come Inoue right here. Coming out first. He looks serious too. Inoue is looking serious as shit. He got his flag behind him. That dude said that, he's walking like uh, Jonathan Majors on uh, on Creed. <laughs> Remember that shit? <laughs> he on that dog. <laughs> yeah, he knew he looks good, dog. He knew he looks good, bro. <laughs> Lol, bitch. Yeah, he knew he looks good, dog. <laughs> 
Yeah, he looking like he on, he like he on this Jonathan Major shit. <laughs> Let me see a nerdy savage. Yeah, I was a nerdy. <laughs> Let me see showbiz. Uh, nothing but a boxing network. Much love, my brother. Hit the Tyson bell. <laughs> Boy, looking confident. Yeah, that's a new way. I'm gonna tell you though. He looks bigger. Pause. I give it to him, dog. Pause. Now you know what? Just erase everything I said, dog. <laughs> Just erase it. Matter of fact. I ain't got much else to say. <laughs> that was so paused. I probably shouldn't even talk for the rest. I shouldn't even commentate. Let me see. Uh, King Kong ain't got on me. Good morning, Biz. Uh, this is crazy. It is crazy. This is a crazy fight, man. This is great. Inoue uh, walking out here uh, like an anime. Uh, the, the racism. All right. Maybe that wasn't. Maybe, you know. <laughs> Maybe that was just a description. <laughs> Let me see. Uh, restart the live. LOL. Yeah, I got to restart the whole live, though. That, that, I got to start over. Like, show biz, uh, don't. <laughs> All right, man, look, I got to do my intro over and everything. Inoue is a, is a, why is, he's a monster. What a fighter. Because Fulton doesn't, is not a guy you should feel confident of. <laughs> He's not a guy you should feel confident fighting, <laughs> right? This guy from Philly, slick fighter, big, like, come on, man. Dog, if he beats Fulton, I'm going to trip out. I don't even know. Like, if Fulton beats him, how shocked would I really be? You know what I'm saying? Like, how shocked would I really be if Inoue beats Fulton? I would be like, man, dude, <laughs> this guy here is really good. <laughs> like, I already think he's really good, but it's just, it'll be like, well, damn. Facts, Biz. Yeah, like, if he beats Fulton, I'll be like, well, that, that, that's something else. <laughs> Underdog. I thought Fulton was the underdog. But in my mind, I, let me see. Working right now. Guide me, brother. By the way, MJ or Prince? MJ, bro. MJ. But, but I did went go song for song, Purple Rain, and uh, Thriller. Song for song. Like one track one versus track one, two versus two. Thriller one. I mean, uh, Purple Rain one, bro. But I can understand why I like Thriller more. But we, me and my woman went song for song and was like, oh shit. Try that. Try that. Try it. Go one, one, two, two. Purple Rain, Rain one by one song. I forgot what it was. Um, Fulton, a fun size, uh, big shine. Funny. Here comes Fulton right now. He, even he's doing the 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 Jonathan Major shit. I'm trying to see how he. I'm trying to see how he rehydrated. Nice touch by Fulton. I'm trying to see how he how he rehydrate. How big he looks. We finally here, gents. Yeah, yeah. This is the beginning of the the best week of boxing history. The these first three rounds would be very important. Facts. Um, Fulton representing Shiniski from Japan with that interest. Oh, I had no idea. Yo, Fulton looks mean. I, uh, I, hey, dog. These are two guys who want to win the fight. And they both believe they will. National Anthem. Morning Biz, boxing at uh, 8 a.m. with orange juice. We need more of this. I got Naoya in 10 or 11. Naoya flattens his tires with body shots. I can see that as the fight grows. I can see that. Because we got to see if 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 that weight cut hurt him. So the body shots will be, I go to the body myself. Can you believe we're looking at Fulton versus Inoue? 
I, I, do y'all, I'm going to be on that again Saturday. I'm going to be like, I'm looking at Spence and Crawford in the ring. This is a fight everybody swear they swore up and down that he knew a wouldn't fight Fulton. Fulton was on his way out, so they so it was like okay, Fulton, and then Fulton stuck around and fought him in Japan. Like this, both of these guys deserve all the credit in the world. All the credit in the world. Hey man, that cool boy is hard to beat, dog. <laughs> I don't know who wins the fight, man. That cool boy is hard to beat, dog. He's the best in his weight class. Y'all, hey, yo, that cool boy ain't, is, is, he's a hard egg to crack. I'm, I'm going to be 100. The whole house is snoozing. This feels great, Biz, doesn't it? No robberies. You ain't lying. I I, I, I don't think I can take a, a robbery. I, I, I just can't take, <laughs> I don't think I can take another one, dog. <laughs> But let's score, yeah, let's score this fight. Uh, I don't think Fulton can uh, rob Inoue in Japan like he did Figueroa. I, I do think Figueroa won the fight, but it was a very close fight. Very close fight. Inoue is like really looking at Fulton. Just how much she was looking at him right there. Man, these guys crazy as shit. The crowd is silent. Yeah. On my way to drop my kids off at daycare. I hope I don't miss too much. Me too. Me too, brother. A uh, cool boy must remain cool with the new A pressure. He will, man. He he's gonna be chilling. He's gonna be chilling, bro. This this fight. He's gonna come right out and just be like, <sighs> and be chilling. He he ain't gonna be over nervous or nothing. Foots and spar boots on occasion. Stop playing. Yeah, bro. Biz, you a scared dude. I'm not. I'm not scared. I'm very happy. Fulton trash. No, he's good. Fulton's very good. My heart is racing. I understand, bro. I got a good G on Inoue. Oh, you put a thousand on Inoue? Who won the anthem? <laughs> uh, 3.5 inch reach advantage. I'm saying, bro, it's, it's not over till it's over. Uh-huh. Uh, we should retire the word robbery and call it uh, the Hannity. <laughs> Dog, stop. Bubble guts. Here we go. Let's look at them. It's time for, it's time for battle. Uh-huh. Fulton looks big. He looks big, but he doesn't look good though. He doesn't look muscular. Right? He does like his his body has looking far better than this. Seriously. Like I'm I just saw his stump. Let me let me look at him again. Let me look at Fulton again. I would go to Fulton's body. What I saw, he didn't look that armored in the body. Let's see how he knew he looks though. He may look chubby or something. Like, let me let me check this out. I'm not, I don't, I don't think, I don't think Fulton looks good. I don't think his, I don't think he looks good. He knew I don't look great either. I, I to be honest, bro, they they both look like this was tough. Oh no, he knew he looks good. Never mind. Never mind. He looks good. Bro, I don't think he looks I don't think he looks good. I don't think Fulton looks good. I don't cuz I don't think Fulton Fulton had to be be careful with how he was training cuz muscle wastes more than fat. Oh shit. Yeah, it looks like Fulton had a bad cut. <laughs> he said Fulton looked like Broner last fight. 
He knew Ace lean on the ropes. Looking forward to his back and everything. He don't look. He doesn't. He doesn't look good. He doesn't look good. Not not to me. But we'll see. If he wins, people will take credit away from him by calling him a cheat when Fulton was just playing mind games. No, but they wrap, he wrapped his hands without stacking them in the back. They, they put it on camera and everything. And it, right in front of their team. And he knew it was like, like this? Like this? That's how you want it? So they can't say anything. Um, Fulton uh, midsection looks sloppy. I'm, man, trillion dollars. That ring looks small as hell. No room to run. It looks small. Well, well, Fulton doesn't run really. I can't tell how small the ring is. I've been looking at it all night. I just can't. I didn't think about it. <laughs> that dude, that dude, he's on, he's on his Jonathan Majors. You know what? I'm going to tell you what he looks like. Fulton looks like how Keith Thoyman used to look. He looks like how Keith Thoyman used to look. Keith Thoyman used to look like, hey, man. And when he started getting hurt to the body and shit, was like, hey, you don't look right. It's so lit, yeah. So, so I like it. Inoue came in first and then was announced last. That's cool. Uh, Errol Spence and Terrence Crawford should do something like that. They introduced the champ first. Yeah, they did the same thing with Canelo and Bibble. But but Fulton came in last in the ring entrance. It makes sense. It's all good. It's all good, though. He's such a big deal in Japan. I didn't know how big of a deal he was, but until this lead up, everybody was talking about how big of a deal he is in Japan. This is going to be good. Yeah, here we go. Inoue needs to needs to go to his bo- dog. Steph, Steph is still big, though. He's still big. He's just big. He's big. I don't like the condition he's in, but he's big though. All right, here Inoue looks like a totally different weight class. He just looks like smaller. Bring the belts back, Steph. All right, here we go. Let's go. They both starting off just flicking the jab at each other, just testing things out. Yeah, Steph is moving side to side. Good, good, nice ways to stay lateral, Fulton. They both toe to toe. They both toe to toe. You could tell. Oh, good jab to the body. Shit, he knew he went straight to the body, bro. He went straight to the body. Why knew he head so? Is it no? His head's humongous. Is that the camera or good jab to the body from me, Nui? Brother, his head is huge. <laughs> Dog. All right, here we go. Good faint from me, Nui. Fulton, look, he's shrinking. So Fulton is. He's bent down very low. He take he taking his ho- his own height away. Good good feints from Fulton. And he knew way is just he's standing taller. Good feints from both. Do I'm telling you, if you knew way come jumping in, Fulton mess around, drop his ass. He knew way is if yeah, Fulton isn't going to punch unless he knew way does. So he knew way is figuring that out. Jab to the body, just oh he knew way is faster than Fulton. It seems like he is, but we'll see. It would make sense. Good jab from Inoue. Good right from Inoue. Inoue is faster than Fulton, dog. Good jab from, from Inoue. I thought, I thought Fulton would be the faster fighter. I don't know why I thought that. There you go. Good jab. Oh, good right hand from Inoue. Good left from Inoue. Inoue doesn't give a shit. Good jab to, from, to the body. Inoue doesn't care. Now Inoue is very cocky now. Fulton don't have the power to. Good jab from Inoue. is out boxing him. Fulton. Fulton, move to the side. Oh, good left from Inoue. Fulton threw a fast shot, but Inoue countered it. But it was a fast jab. It was a very fast jab. 
Fulton just got to be faster. He just got to be faster. Got Oh, good jab from Inoue. He just got to punch faster than he's punching. Good jab to the body from Inoue. That jab to the body is going to be everything. Fulton, what's up with your... Your leg? Fulton's legs. Good laugh from... Fulton, your leg. Shit. What do you do, bro? 40 seconds in the first. Good jab. Your... Your legs, right, just missed. Move. Twenty-five seconds. He knew he was walking Fulton down. Oh, good right hand, but 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 he knew he countered with the left. I think that right hand missed from Fulton. What the hell? He knew he slipped. Oh, good right from he knew he in the clinch. Now he knew he roughed him up. He should. He should. When he gets in close like that, he should rough him up. But the ref is warning about the rabbit punches. Good, good shit, ref. Fulton getting stopped in the fight. That that was that was some good refing right there. That was some good refing right there. He knew, I'm 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 concerned. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Inoue looks far better than Fulton. All right, so I'm I'm a bit concerned. Maybe Fulton needs to get. Yes, yeah, clearly one zero from Inoue. Maybe Fulton needs to get in his bag. Because he knew he was, was he just looked better. But I don't like his, I don't like Fulton's legs. It's like he couldn't get out of the way. It just seemed like he couldn't get out the way. It was, it, it's also how good Inoue's feet is. So it's both. It's like Inoue was able to cover ground so quick that that is going to be ugly later if Fulton doesn't – he got to be busier with his jab. All right, here we go. Another jab from Fulton. Good jab from Inoue. Good jab from Inoue. Oh, good right hand. He hurt Fulton with a right hand. If I, Good right hand. Good body shot. Inou, oh, Inoue whooping his ass, dog. I, I thought – I thought I didn't know Inoue was that much faster than Fulton. <gasps> right hand just missed. Inoue's trying to knock his ass out. Fulton looks hurt. Fulton looks hurt. Good jab from Inoue. Fulton, look, Fulton's starting to bounce. The monster is going to get him. Right hand from Inoue. He's chasing Fulton. Inoue's, Inoue's didn't, he didn't rush it. Smart, smart. Fulton, you got to, you got to, good, oh, good right hand from Inoue. Oh, good right hand from Inoue. He's throwing beautiful shots. Where where Fulton is going to be. That is just beautiful accuracy. Inoue is throwing where Fulton is going to be. Beautifully. Right hands miss. Look, look, Inoue said, come on. Bam! Left hook. Inoue, I'm telling you, that guy got, oh, good. He got beautiful feet and head movement. The guy is magnificent. Inoue is magnificent, dog. Good jab. He's, he's, he's just, fuck, what the hell, bro? He's playing with Fulton. He's out boxing them and playing with them. Good jab from Fulton. He knew he said, "Good jab from Inoue." He knew he can fight. One minute twenty seconds. Yeah, yeah. He said, "Watch that." Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Yeah, that's old school. You see, that's that Philly. He, he tried to step on Inoue's feet. That's that Philly dog. But that ref is am, am, amazing. That ref needs to come on over and ref for us every fight. Like, I need him for Spence versus Crawford right now. Good jab, Fulton. Oh, good right hand from Inoue. Fulton cannot. He's having a hard time with the feet. Like, Inoue's, oh, good right. Oh, good right again. Inoue hit him with a beautiful. Fulton's scared of shit. Fulton! 40 seconds in the second round. Good jab, Inoue. Damn, I can't, but I'm screaming Fulton, but I don't know what he should do. There you go, Fulton's walking forward. Right hand miss. Yeah, Fulton's like, I ain't going to go easily, bro. You can kiss my ass. Jabbed Fulton's feet looking strange. 25 seconds on the second. Good jab from Inoue. I don't know what I want Fulton to do. Right hand. Oh, good, good left. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, he got him against the ropes. Inoue, hey, I'm terrified. <laughs> He's the monster because I'm terrified. Oh, good shit. I'm scared. I'm not even, I'm like, Fulton, run, run. 
I don't know. Shit. <laughs> I'm like, Fulton, get out of there. That Fulton looked like he's seen the J J Japanese Jesus. Yeah, I'm like, Fulton, run. <laughs> Let you, I don't know what I want Fulton to do because he knew a feet. He's like, he's on his Pacquiao shit. I'm Fulton like, yo, if I can just figure out, oh, never mind. Like, if I can figure out where you're going to be, maybe I can start getting busy. You know what I mean? And the thing is, Inoue is landing big shots. So it's it's discouraging Fulton. But Fulton, being offensive, he, he went forward. Like, let me try to go forward, bro. <laughs> I can't believe this, bro. God, this man. <laughs> Oh, I thought it was one punch. He, Fulton, how the hell is Inoue out jabbing Fulton? Now, now that I didn't expect. All right, here we go. Hey, he's stepping on his feet. Fulton, go ahead, Fulton. Good jab to the body. Jab on from Inoue. That's that Philly, dog. He, oh, 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 go ahead, Fulton. A little double jab. He's working. Oh, Fulton say, I'm about to work. I'm about to work. Work, 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 work. A little jab to the body from Fulton. Oh, shit. Oh, oh good jab from Inoue. Oh, jab to the body, jab on stage. Inoue is nice, man. He's nice. Fulton's like, I'm going forward. Ba oh, good right hand from Inoue. Fulton said, no, no, baby, no. Good jab from Inoue. Fulton said, no, baby. Jab, Fulton. Oh, don't just flick the jab. Don't nip it on the bell. Pull the trigger. Right hand, Fulton, is there. Inoue is baiting him. He's baiting him. Oh, good right hand. Oh, he hurt Fulton. He's baiting him. Fulton, your legs look like... Like Apollo Creed and Rocky IV. I ain't going to lie to you, brother. Your legs look like shit. Now, I, I don't know what you were doing, bro. You you should have did more squats. or Oh, good jab to the body from me, Oh, oh, those punches. Yeah, do Philly. That's that Philly chin. That's that Philly chin. Right hand miss. Fulton, punch. Oh, good jab from me, Nui. If you're going to punch, punch, bro. There you go. Shoot the jab. Don't just throw it. Punt. Land. J jab to the body from Inoue. Fulton, get off the line. Good jab. Get off the line. Move your hand. There you go. Good uh, jab just missed. Inoue just waiting to counter. He's, he's playing you, Fulton. Good jab from Inoue. Inoue's playing you. He got, he beat the IQ. Uh, Inoue said, check the feet. He's stepping on my feet again. Oh, good jab from Inoue. Check the corns. <laughs> he's, chepping, he's stepping on my bunions. <laughs> good jab from, oh, good right to the body from Inoue. Inoue swam without getting wet. That boy swam without, <gasps> good jab. Inoue's whooping your ass. Hey, Fulton. 55 seconds in the third. Good right hand. Oh, oh good combination from Inoue. Boy, he's knocking your ponytail all over. Good right hand from Inoue. Your ponytail is everywhere, bruh. Good jab. 40 seconds, cool boy. To do something. Land a big shot, cool boy. Get do something. Get some respect. Good jab to the body. The jab to the body from Inoue is magnificent. Like that is a for sure right on. Like 25 seconds. Shit. Dog, he's Pacquiao, dog. <laughs> that was a good one, two from. Oh, one, two again from Inoue. He dog, now your lip busted. You can't say no when you're bleeding from your mouth, dog. Your mouth is on this period, and you're like, no, that ain't, brother, you, you got to say yes. Oh, left foot just missed from Inoue. Get out the way, Fulton. Just get, just get out the way, bro. Good. Oh, uppercut miss. Good block. Dog, that, you bleeding all through here. <laughs> <laughs> bro, that Fulton's bleeding all through, bro. Let me see. Bro, there's no B plan when the A plan is doable, <laughs> Fulton, <laughs> damn. brother, damn. <laughs> the jab to the body and the whole nine, dog. That's 3-0 Inoue, bro. The body shots. Who, who is his trainer? Customato? <laughs> Who's his trainer, dog? Inoue got the best preparation I've ever seen. <laughs> we told him to go to the body, and that's exactly what he's doing. 
Fulton, you should have did more road work, bro. The double jab from Fulton. There you go, head. Keep, keep your head off the line. There you go, Fulton. Keep that. Fulton, give me a round. Give me a round and build off of it. Good jab from me, New Way. One round, bro. One. Good jab. Yeah, Fulton threw a right. He said, shit, I, I got another hand. Oh, good right hand from me, New Way. Oh, good right hand from me. Oh, shit. Hey, Fulton. Oh, Fulton, get out. Fulton, get out of there. Good, good jab, Fulton. There you go. Oh, good jab to the body from Inoue. Little night. Oh, Inoue is not an effective clincher. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, I feel you, Philly. I feel you, cool boy. Cool boy said, I'm about to just fight. Forget it. I'm I'm toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Forget it. Oh, good jab. Oh, shit. Inoue almost dropped him with a jab. Now, he, he, double jab. Fulton, right hand. There you go. I just needed one right hand, Fulton. That's all I needed. I'm good now, brother. You you can go ahead and get knocked out now. I just went, oh, one, two from Inoue. Oh, oh, oh. Inoue just, yeah, Inoue balled up his lip. Now, when you fight somebody, go, mm, that, that's one minute, 50 seconds. That jab to the body from Inoue <laughs> is nuts. Double jab, Fulton. Work. Jab to the body from Inoue. Jab to the body from Inoue. Jab to the body from me. New hey, Fulton, he's going to keep jabbing you to the body now. Counter, counter with the right hand now. Counter with the right hand, playboy. Right hand just missed. Fulton, commit. There you go. Right hand from Fulton. Nice way to commit. It was after the jab. I'm about to give a sympathy. Oh, not, never mind. That left hook just hurt Fulton. That was a left hook from me. New way. Big swing and a miss from Fulton. Oh, yo, I, Fulton, take, I like how Fulton taking the fight to him. He ain't going out. Fulton is taking a fight. He knew he's whooping his ass, but Fulton's like, yo, good jab to the body. Jab upstairs from Inoue. This brother knows. Looks like he's a vampire. It looks like he just bit someone's neck. There's so much blood out of his mouth and nose. 55 seconds left. In the oh, good jab from Inoue. Duh, I want to get... Oh, oh I, want to, I wanted to give you this round, Fulton. I'm, I, I'm just trying to give you one, bro. Good jab to the body. Oh, good round. Oh, shit. Inoue got him against the ropes. Fulton, get out of there. Get, there you go, Fulton. Yeah, bring that Philly out. Bring that Philly out. Let them know, baby. We from Philly. We from Philly. We eat the Philly steaks. Yeah, we want that cheese steak. Mm. He knew he done push Fulton across the damn ring. and it, Oh, good jab. Swim without getting wet. Right hand. Oh, good right hand from Inoue. Right hand again. Combination from Fulton. Work. Oh, good left foot. Inoue, you, you, you evil, dog. You know he's trying his best. Oh, good jab, Fulton. Good job, Fulton. Oh, shit. He knew it. Oh, he's falling again. Fulton, your legs, brother, you need you need a, you need a wrench and tighten up all the tendons in your legs. I, somebody got to give him a wrench and just tighten up. He need to put his legs in the dryer machine or something and tighten up all the tendons. Let me see. The jab to the body is Floyd like, yeah, this boy right here done turned into Money Mayweather. Roll out. Inoue is like, I'm letting an American with a ponytail make me look sweet. <laughs> yeah, I got 4-0 Inoue. Uh, Box and Ego going to look stupid after this. <laughs> Dog, let, 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 let everybody get theirs off, bro. Let me see. Uh, One-sided fight. Yeah, it's one-sided, though. Is one, yeah, it's for OE New Way, dog. I, I wanted to give Fulton that round. I was begging to give him that round, bro. I was like, please. <laughs> Fulton, boom, by A. Like, I'm like, I'm like, please. All right, here we go. Okay. See, the thing about a new way is he's not reaching. He's not overreaching. He's not overcommitting. Oh, good jab. Good jab. Oh, oh shit. That jab was coming from. <gasps> good. That jab coming from the shoulders, dog. That jab coming from the shoulders, dog. Oh, good jab again from Inoue. That jab come. Oh, oh, right here. Oh, good. Oh, there. And then he swam without getting wet. Inoue threw a combination, him and the body, and swam without getting wet. <gasps> oh, that, that uppercut would have been nasty. Good jab from, from Fulton. Good jab from Inoue. They toe to toe, though. Your legs. I, you know, man. Oh, good combination. Good combination from me, New Way. Brother, your legs, bro. Oh, good. Oh, good combination from me, New Way. Fulton, Fulton got a chin. Can kiss my ass. Because that's the monster. Oh, good combination, uh, Fulton. It was a one two on the chin of the New Way. Oh, good combination from me, New Way.
Well, they're like, no, hell no, nah, baby. He's like, hell no, nah, baby. You hit me on my in my face. Oh, good job. Oh, good right. Shit. <laughs> that right hand looked weird. <laughs> that that knocked Fulton off balance, dog. Oh, good right hand from Fulton. Yeah, Fulton's starting to land on your way. He's on. Oh, good right hand from me, new way. Fulton's starting to land a little, little bit on you. Hey, I'm going to tell you this. Oh, good job from me, new way. That gives a little bit more respect to Nonito Donaire, doesn't it? That first fight, no Nito, dog. The second fight was a whooping. But the first fight, you got to give no Nito his love for how much work he gave the new way. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Right hand just missed from Cool Boy. Cool Boy trying to knock his ass out. I, I'm telling you, Cool Boy trying to drop the new way's ass. Good job from Cool Boy. He tried to drop his ass. He knew I took the round off. Good job from me, Nui. Hey, go ahead, Fulton. Fulton, you may take one. You may take one. One minute left in the fifth. Oh, good right hand. Oh, left hand just missed from oh, Inoue. Shot the jab. Go shoot the jab, Fulton. Take, give me a round, baby. Give me a round. Shit, you never know. One, one step at a time. One, one jab from Inoue. Oh, right hand from Inoue. I don't know, dog. Uh, uh. Oh, the nice little comp, nice little. Oh, good jab. We knew he's jab is lethal. Oh, ah, he jabbed Fulton and he said, ah, you see Fulton face that. Ah. <laughs> good jab for me. <laughs> Shit hurt, man. Like, ah. Oh, good left hook. Damn, Fulton, you never, you can never just take the round, bro. 15 seconds. Good jab. Right hand. Hey, dog, you. All right, dog. All right, dog. Good, good right hand. It, it's, it's over with, dog. There are five seconds left for the fifth. Brother. Brother. <laughs> this is just an ass beating. This is an ass beating. Please, <laughs> please hit the like. Yeah, please hit the like, bro. Uh, this is what Arrow meant uh, by one side of that. Yeah, this is an ass whipping, dog. <laughs> this is an ass whipping. Five Asian baddies visited Fulton last night. Yeah, somebody took his legs, bro. Somebody took his legs, bro. Cause, brother, this is an ass whipping. Now, I... <laughs> four one. There you go, dog. There you go, dog. I got it five zero. Oh, but somebody four one. Go ahead, boy. A mate, uh, tool, uh, boy, Fulton getting work. Yeah, he's getting work, dog. He's getting work. I got it 5 0, but somebody gave it 4 1. Go ahead. Go ahead. Shit, I don't give a damn. You gave him 4 1. I'm, I'm feeling you, dog. Give Fulton a round. I got it 5 0, though, but give him a round, dog. Here we go. Shit. Work off that last round, Fulton. That was your best round. Triple jab from Inoue. Inoue. Inoue is not rushing it. He's trying to let it come to him, which he just, he just, good jab, good jab again. He just, he just in the, now their body's doing it on their own. They're just, they're just in a groove. They're both in a groove. Fulton is stepping forward. Fulton is like, yo, I'm, damn, I thought that right hand landed from Fulton. Fulton's like, we, I, damn it, I came to fight. Now, good jab to the body from Inoue. But I, I'm, I'm going to be honest though. Not 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 to not to shoot for to no bail, not to shoot him any bail. So I'm not making excuses, but his legs weren't his legs aren't good enough right now. How about that? Now, because now he's he, he has to fight in a slugging way, kind of. Good jab. He can't his legs not good going backwards. He stumbles going backwards. So now he's just going forward. Good. Oh, good. Oh, he knew he was so smart to push his head down after that missing that right hand. Jab from from Fulton. You know where somebody's legs at with how they look going backwards. Good jab to the body from 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 Inoue. Oh, good left hook. Oh, good right hand. That was a beautiful combination from Inoue. He threw a left jab, left hook. Okay. Fulton came in with, with a one-two-one. One. He missed a one-two, but he landed the one. You know what I mean? Good jab from Inoue. Jab to the body. Whoop. Good head movement, Inoue. That was beautiful. Inoue is starting to pressure uh, Fulton a little bit. Oh, good counter left. <laughs> Shit. Oh, good right hand. Uppercut. No, his combinations. 
Oh, he knew a brother is really good. Oh, I'm telling you, man. I've been telling you guys, this guy's like the best fighter in the world, man. Oh, oh, good right hand, Fulton. Nice one. Oh, good uppercut, he knew a on a, on a break. Good left hook. <laughs> Shit, man. Oh, good jab, Fulton. Disrupt that right hand. Oh, good. Oh, good combination from he knew a. When when he knew he lets his hands go, it's really dangerous. I love that sneaky jab from Fulton while Inoue trying to throw his right hand. He's intercepting the right hand of Inoue. Good jab. Oh, shit. He's beat busted. Fulton up. Oh, good right hand from Inoue. Hey, I'm going to tell you this. I'm going to make a comment. Inoue is way better than Fulton. Good jab. Good jab from Inoue. Inoue hurt him with a jab. He hit him with a jab, uppercut. I'm going to tell y'all, good right hand from Fulton. Good right hand from Inoue. Hey, I'm going to tell you, man, Inoue is way better than him. Inoue is way better than him. Hannity versus uh, uh, Loma Judge. Here I got it, uh, 6 -0 Fulton. <laughs> I'm going to let y'all know, bro. I'm going to let y'all know. Uh, did somebody say uh, uh, sugary? There's levels. Yeah, he's way better. He's way better, dog. This fight, this, this fight, this is crazy. Yeah, this fight was, it was 50-50, I felt. But in reality. He knew he's way better than him. I mean, Fulton ain't even, he ain't on the new age level. All right, here we go. Good jab. Oh, oh, good right hand from Inoue. Good jab to the body from Inoue. I mean, because he's out boxing him. He's not slugging him. He's out landing and, and, and evading and, He's better than him. Right hand from Fulton. He clipped him, but I gave him that punch. I don't give a shit. I, I'll say he landed it, dog. Even if he missed. Yeah, I, I gave it to Fulton, bro. You landed it, dog. Two, two minutes, 25 seconds. In the <laughs> shit. Oh, right hand from Inoue. Inoue's kind of chased Fulton around a little bit right there. He knew he can, Fulton can't land. You know what Fulton needs to do? I'll jump into my shot. Forget it. I'll just go reach it. Good left hook from Inoue. I'll go reaching for him, dog. Right hand just missed. I'll go reaching for him, dog. Oh, good jab. Oh, good right hand from Fulton. Inoue hurt. Inoue hurt. Oh, good combination from Inoue. Is he? Wait, I thought he was hurt. I don't give a... I guess not. He... That, he he shrugged that off like it wasn't shit. I like that right hand from Fulton. It it banged that head. And I I say, yo, that big head got rocked. I don't care what anybody, but no, I guess not. But I I maybe it was wishful thinking. He knew it ain't hurt like that brother was chilling. Little jab to the body. Fulton, like, let me swim without getting wet. I, I'm giving Fulton. Oh, good. Well, shit. Oh, good combination. Oh, shit. From me, anyway. I was trying to give Fulton around, dog, because he landed that one. That one right hand, that one right hand was worth 150 points, baby. It was worth 150 punches, dog. Good right hand, Fort. Oh, good right hand from Inoue. Ah, see, Inoue got that little ass eye. When Inoue gets that little ass eye, bro, you know his own. He got that, that busted orbital bone eye. Remember that? Uh-oh. Oh, good right hand from, from Inoue. 40 seconds in the, in the seventh. Big swing in the middle. Oh, 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 good combination from, oh, shit. He knew he letting his hands go on, on Fulton. Damn, man, I wanted to give Fulton that round, dog. That one punch, though. That good jab, Fulton. Man, I'm about to give him a round, dog. I, <laughs> oh, good left hook from me, do I? No, I'm about to just give him one, dog. I, hey, it's 6-1, dog. Now, now I don't, I don't know what round it is, but he won one. Now, you can kiss my ass. It's 6-1. Oh, good right hand, Fulton. Yeah. 
Oh, good job, Fulton. Six one. No, no, six one. Now, now, I'm at six one. A new way. That boy got him around in. You can kiss my ass. Six one. Man. Good fight. Good fight. <laughs> So one sided exfoliant dog. <laughs> uh, let me see. Uh, Fulton needs to let that dog out his cage and fight. Yeah, I let my hands go. I'll be like, look, I would, I would really be like, I'm bigger than him. You know, I'm about to let my hands go. All right, eighth round. You knew he might as well move up to 126 and 130 after this fight. I'm saying, bro, why, why I'll stick around? Why I'll stick around? You beat the best here. A charity round. Yeah, I'm giving them a charity round. That's six one. Y'all, yeah. Call me whatever y'all want. Man, well, call me what y'all want. That's six one, dog. Good double jab from, from Fulton. Shoot. Good jab to the body from me, New A. Fulton, like, yeah, I'm here, baby. Oh, good jab from me, New A. Good jab, Fulton. He hurt. He hurt Fulton bad. Fulton got knocked out. Fulton's knocked out. Damn. Fulton, he's the monster. He's scary. Fulton's out. Oh, he got up. Fulton got up. That was a nasty combination. Fulton, oh, shit. Fulton just walked away for no reason. Oh, God. Fulton don't know where he's at. Somebody. Somebody stop him. <laughs> the guys, he's whooping Fulton's ass. Somebody stop the fight! He knocked Fulton out! Somebody stop the fight! That punch was fast as shit! Inoue is the best fighter in the world for the next three days. And that's the Black Two Sugars. He's the best fighter in the world for the next three days. He beat him easily. Flex on him. What's up, Biz? I can't watch the fight, but man, I'm enjoying your commentary on my drive to work. Your pure excellence. Keep it up. Thank you so much, my brother. This dude is the best fighter for the next three days. Inoue knocked him. <laughs> the monster knocked out Fulton, beat him one-sidedly, and he didn't stack the hand wrap. No excuses. He didn't stack the hair wraps. He said, is this how you want it? Any excuses tonight, Fulton? And then said, ah, and knocked him out. Over with, bruh. Over, give him his roses. Give him his roses. And I was rooting for Fulton. Oh, uh, man, I don't even care. Pound for pound number one tied with Spencer Crawford. I don't even care. Yeah, that, no excuses. I don't want to hear shit. That dude wrapped his hands, and my man had a phone on it. He said, here, yeah. he said, you got it recorded? This is how you want it? Any excuses tonight, Fulton? <laughs> he beat him. He's, he wasn't even in his class. It wasn't a 50-50 fight. It was one-sided. Next three days only. Love you, boy. Yeah, for. Dog, Fulton wasn't scared. He couldn't mess with him. Roy Jones and Card. Yeah, Charles Atwood. My man, where's Charles Atwood at? Charles Atwood. Cheese. His name is Cheese. They think they don't cheese. fuck with me, but. <laughs> bling, bling. King Kong ain't got. Sh On Cheese. 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 To the body, right hand. How fast he knew he is. He knew I just, oh, dog, I was ready to call the fight right there. Oh, he got him all over like a, a beach umbrella blown in a hurricane. Oh, Lord. <laughs> brother, brother, no, no. <laughs> was that a horse? Yeah, no, nah. it, it was supposed to have been Godzilla, but I didn't know how to. 
Dang. <laughs> However you do it. Bruh. 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 That. Hey, hey, hey. Full just said, I'm good. I'm good. Brother, that there. <laughs> Three dollars. Thank you so much for the cash app, brother. That right there wasn't even close. <laughs> that wasn't even close. No stack hand wraps. Nothing. <laughs> what is that? Just not, nothing. Y'all try to conspiracy. Do whatever y'all want. Run with it. <laughs> Run with it, dog. Because I'm I'm over here, brother. Please. Uh, that level change reminds me of how Canelo set up Amir Khan. Yeah, it was something like that. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn, that hurt. Bruh. Something like that. Mm -mm. That came out of nowhere. <laughs> the odds don't lie. Brother, please. Brother, please. Brother, please. He beat the shit. Yeah, give him his roses, bro. He he's he and, and the funny thing is, there's nothing to be said. And beat your umbrella in a hurricane, <laughs> brother. That's what it was all, dog. The monster, brother. There's nothing to be said. He won't fight Fulton, though. He got nobody on his resume. Who did he really fight? Then he fights Fulton. Oh, stack hand wraps. Then he let them record how he wraps his hands, and then he knocks them out. All of it is bullshit. Naoya Inoue is the monster. Y'all should believe in him now. If y'all had any questions, y'all should believe in him now. Uh, he's number one pound for pound. He achieved more than Bud and Spence. Let me see. Flex on him. Seep, 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 pow. King Kong ain't got... On me, yeah, I'm a believer now. That was easy, man. Now on uh, to Saturday. Yep, I love that you said that, Brandon. The funny thing is, Brandon, oh, uh, let me see. The funny thing is, we all knew it. <laughs> thank, thank you so much, my brother. We all were talking about how good he was, and I was called a sellout and hate my black people all because I thought how good he knew he was. You know what I mean? But now it's like we y'all finally saw what we been saw. We, this guy been fighting fantastic fighters his whole career and demonstrated on Fulton. It just had to be a fighter that y'all knew. Once it became a fighter that you were aware of, now you get it. Here's the thing, though. I, if I was him, I'd move up. Uh, Fulton has his team got what they deserve and completely outclassed by being outboxed and knocked out. Outclassed, outboxed, and knocked out. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's greatness. That's greatness, bro. I I would I I would I would move the hell up, bro. I would move up. Why not? Tank versus Inoue after that wipeout. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Number one, Biz Natic here. Damn, damn, that hurt. That's the black two time two sugars, bro. The sweet science. Uh huh. 7,000 watching. Yeah, everybody showed up, bro. Everybody showed up and showed out. Everybody showed out on a Tuesday. Let me see. Flex on them. Dog, that right there. Seep, 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 pow. King Kong ain't got on me. Time for taco. Brother, I, no taco Tuesday. I'm going to bed. Currently, 3.45 p.m. in Kenya. Oh, uh, got out of work early to watch the new way out boxing out class the box of greatness. Yep. 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 Yo, know, I, 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 I don't know. I, and it's, it's going to be something else. It's going to be something else. Another fake conspiracy for another fight. Another race baiting tactic on another fight. Another bullshit. Like, but. I just want y'all to know what they do. Just learn from it. All right? Don't trip and go for every little bait. Oh, let me see. Dang. Uh, two through that. Yeah, yeah, who threw that rock, bro? Who threw that rock? Let me see. That last uh, launch uh, with the left was like, was a mofo. Oh, my God. Biz, what a performance. He surprised me. I'm, I'm yeah. Yeah, he actually surprised me. <laughs> he surprised me in the fact that Fulton is a big, slick fighter. So it, 
Yeah. That, to beat him that bad, outbox him and knock him out. That that that's amazing. That is amazing. Uh, you know, I I I would I wouldn't be I wouldn't have been surprised if he knew a one, but the fight wasn't even close. So that did surprise me. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. The fight not being close surprised the shit out of me. Uh, let me see. That shows how good Onito Donaire is. I know. I'm try- that's what I was trying to tell people, bro. Uh, had that boy ponytail flopping in the wind. My goodness, we are witnessing greatness this year. I'm saying. He knew he's a mutant. There's nothing to be said. Oh, okay. I can't. I don't know what he's saying. I don't speak Japanese. Uh, thank you so much. Hit the Tyson Bam. <laughs> Bruh, I'm telling you. You made my day biz, brother. Let me tell you. Let me tell you something, bro. Let me tell you something, bro. Let me tell you. He's the best fighter in the world until Saturday, though. He's the best fighter in the world until Saturday. <laughs> My man called him lame boy stuff. Now everybody, somebody said robbery. <laughs> Should he new way go for undisputed at junior featherweight and go up another weight class? Love your content. Yes. He just beat the best fighter at 120. There is no, I, what do you do? What do you do? I would go up, bro. He just beat the best. What, I mean, what? What do you do? <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> Thank you so much, brother. Y'all need to stop overrating these slick fighters. That's true. That's very true. Uh, let me see. Uh, turn me the F up. Bruh. He knew a pit bull crew was funny. Fight tank. Come on, dog. Come on, dog. Come on, dog. Chill. <laughs> All of a sudden, it's fight Tank. I did a video that was like Tank versus Inoue in the future. It's going to be Floyd versus Pacquiao all over again. And everybody said, ah, ah, he's too small. All of a sudden, it's fight Tank. Y'all, y'all need to go head on. I got the video. Read the comments. Read the comments. I got the video. Read Now y'all fight Tank. Get y'all fair weather microwave ass out a uh, one two uh five eight <laughs> let me see uh might be the first two time undisputed if Crawford uh falls short uh I think he should stay for a while <laughs> yeah show biz let's see him move up against Oscar Valdez or Leo Santa Cruz after tank 135 uh he's a great match for them man sh- I just like where he's, he he just fought at 122. Y'all talking about 135. That's that's how great he looked tonight. Y'all talking about 135. He just fought at 122. Uh, Biz, they'll come up with any to discredit discredit a win. Yeah. It's not about giving love. It's about, it's about how they feel inside, making them feel better about themselves. It's like, you didn't fight. You don't have to do that, bro. You don't have to imprint your emotions on the fight. Bro, he knew way kicked ass. Let me see. You knew a versus tank is pack versus Floyd on steroids. <laughs> yeah. Bruh. Tank might end his career. I, w- that fight ain't happening. Why talk about it? It's not happening. It's, it's not happening though. All right. He's at 135. He knew he's at 122, bro. Not, not happen. All right. Now, you may want to get Inoue versus Lomachenko at 126, something like that. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, not hating, but I want Tank versus Nick. He's 122. He's 122. He just got there from 118. This is first fight at 122. We were calling him too small for Fulton. Now y'all want Tank at 135? Wake up. Let him get there. Let him. Let's see. Can he get, can he have this win for a second? <laughs> let's see. Carissa, first uh, two-time undisputed. Yeah, DJ. Talking about for men, though, but yeah. Damn. <laughs> let me see. Inoue 
hold on, Inoue the truth. I want to see uh, Louis Neer. Oh, versus, ah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Casemiro versus Inoue. That'd be beautiful, too. That'd be beautiful, too. Bro. Inoue is our last hope against Thanos. <laughs> Abyss, this is embarrassing. Fulton made him do all that just to get Molly whopped. Uh huh. But Fulton didn't. It was Fulton's team. That's why I said Fulton is so sad. Uh, he should have uh, even. He shouldn't have even shown up to the post press. Shouldn't even show up to the post press. Yeah, he should. Th uh, let me see. Thanks for covering this mismatch, bro. <laughs> uh, Inoue is just too damn fast bro yeah i don't care about no size at disadvantages with him speed advantages are sometimes more important than brother his timing and his boxing ability his boxing ability later today boxing ego will come in with the birth certificate sam fulton was an undefeated native american fighter stop uh wilder versus he knew right wilder versus he knew brother fulton got hurt so bad and then that left bam that's the accuracy i'm talking about <laughs> Y'all, Fulton eyes were already closed. Can you imagine that? To get hit and your eyes are closed, and it's like, bro, that is bad. Boom. <laughs> Bing. <laughs> like, how are you going to put me to sleep and wake me up? Look at that slow motion. That was pop. <laughs> Bing. <laughs> that's, that's not cool at all. <laughs> that's trauma. That's called trauma, bro. Look at Tim Bradley. That stacking, that that increases your power by ten times in an Infinity Gauntlet. I thought Fulton was just starting to settle in. Timothy Bradley is starting to. He got a save face. With the 10, 10 times the power shit. <laughs> Flex on them. Appreciate the commentary. Can't wait. Uh, can't watch. So enjoying the energy. Thank you so much, brother. Joe Biz going to delete the channel. What? Brother, he hit him. The dude went to sleep and woke up. Five dollars from Aaron Owens. Thank you so much, brother. Brother, brother. What happened to the ten times the power? Shit. Oh, uh, let me see. Uh, uh, he did his thing. Uh huh. I think Oscar Valdez is a good matchup, though. He would trade, and Oscar is good at trading heavy shots. That's firework fight. Uh, I got Inoue because of the footwork and the speed. You know, um, Inoue is a very good fighter, not just power puncher and not just fast and athletic. He's a he's a high level, high IQ, great defense. Like he's a great fighter. He's a fantastic fighter. Uh, Naoya, uh, belt snatcher Inoue, funny, funny. Um, I often wonder why we make so much about weight when Wilder versus Fury was 50 pounds difference. We made, we made, yeah, we were talking about that too. Like, what? <laughs> That's why we, what do you mean, brother? They, they were making the bridge weight class because of that fight. They were trying to make a whole tweener weight class between, brother, uh, he turned Fulton into Fulton. <laughs> dog, uh, f -f 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 dog, this a lot of people. F -f 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 those LDBC channel. Uh, channels will say Inoue cheated by putting uh, wasabi sauce and, and his gloves. Uh, he has a history or juice it and cheating it. Dog, I, brother, I ain't got that. I ain't talking. I ain't got that kind of time, brother. Let me see. Uh, Tank versus Inoue is crazy, but Spence about to do Crawford the same way. No, he ain't going to do him. No, <laughs> it's going to be a close fight. Uh, I need Rubise Ramirez versus Inoue next. Uh, my man, MJ, get right. Inoue got crazy power, brother. That 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 dude, Inoue is on steroids. There you go. That's the next thing. That's the next thing, right? If if Inoue was an American or if he looked like you, he'd just be great. 
any if he's not looking like you, he's on steroids or cheated or whatever. That's how people are tribalism, which is why this whole thing, the whole controversy thing, even happened. Uh, let me see. It's it's lame, <laughs> but uh, let me see, David. Uh, the fight was over from the second. Uh, once he knew a new Fulton uh couldn't hurt him, he walked him down. Yeah, brother, when he found out, I knew it was over when he knew a was faster. When Fulton threw a jab and he knew I did. I said, oh, wait. <laughs> I did not know he was fast. I thought Fulton had the speed. <laughs> he knew it was fast. Let me see. He got the spirit of Pacquiao and Bruce Lee. Duh, y'all, I don't know. I Y'all funny. I think it's clear that he knew a is the second coming of Manny. Give <laughs> him some years. We're going to possibly see one of the best. Yeah, he's what Kobe is was to Michael Jordan. You know what I mean? Uh, we're gonna be putting their fight side by side and watch him doing the same moves. Uh, he knew a fight IQ is incredible, yeah, but his power and timing speed just might be too much. I think he moves up weight class is fine, yeah, yeah. I got the video, I made a video four years ago, four years ago, and what look it up, look up showbiz Naoya Inoue, you'll find it. And I said, Is Naoya Inoue? going to be the next eight division world champion read the comments to that read that was four years ago so i've been new what was up with dude let me see was rooting for fulton but he knew as that guy yeah he's that he's the truth until somebody come up with some other conspiracy and everybody eat on it and feed on it and 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 be tools and be tools he knew a versus showbiz i'll get him out of there dog do hit the like yeah everybody hit the like Hit the like. What's up, people? This show biz. The uh, uh, thought Fulton was going to get uh Picasso. Yeah, I thought he was about to get Picasso. <laughs> I thought he was about. To, let me see. Uh, he has the Pac Man calves. <laughs> he would be at uh one forty. Dog at one forty, he forty, he'd be punching hard. Been a fan of Fulton since two thousand twenty. Stayed up all night just to see him on the floor. He you say you're selling them out. Uh, Manny outside, uh, son, uh, John Snow, funny. Called him the bastard child of Manny Pacquiao. He's trying to become undisputed at 122. I got you. I got you. Go ahead. Go. Ahead. You might as well. Yeah, yeah. Be undisputed at 122, dog. Let that weight settle in and then. Yeah, you, you got it. You got it, dog. You got it. All right, man. Thank you guys for showing up and showing out. I'm about to take my ass to bed. I got a meeting a little bit later. I may actually do the morning after right now. I'll do the morning after video. And the LDBC already making excuses. Stop. Stop brother brother please thank you guys for showing up and showing out show biz the don't i hope you guys enjoyed the show nailia inoue best fighter in the world one or two something like that i'm out huh he ain't, he ain't three that dude's one or two bro <laughs>